Also, thank you for to Kubo Jiro who nice followed, room. and Original and Gay, and um, I also noticed that uh, Lauren Coco followed, but I don't know if that was when Isaac was streaming or when we started Samantha. Welcome to Living by Samantha, people! It's been a week because I was working on Isaac's computer, so I took a break off of the Samantha stream. At any rate, we join our wonderful hostess and heroine as she sleeps through her day. I think she needs to turn in that uh, one... I have four gifts to accept. I don't know if that's going to work. We'll try that, though. And two friend requests online. We'll deal with that later. Um... But I don't know if, uh, I think she still has to turn in that one job. But for those of you who are new Twilight to the Onion. channel... Twilight Onion! Mo Asu Thank you for the reset for seven months! Mo Salmon! Salmon! Um, for those of you who are new to the channel, be aware that our story begins when our amazing divine designer, Salmon. Angela Keeperton, was lost to us. Salmon. That's how you say it, honey. But Angela Keeperton was lost to us on vacation with her adopted daughter in France. Unfortunately, unfortunately, we are left with Samantha Pickering. Samantha Pickering is a beautiful woman whose main goal is to carry on what Angela started, but she wishes to carry it to new heights through being the most perfect hostess that she possibly can be. <clears throat> she plans to show everyone how Black to better face. themselves, to better their lives, and to better those people around them. And let us not forget her lovable and adorable Butterscotch. Butterscotch is an adorable little puppy, and Butterscotch will, is the most perfect accessory that any girl could possibly have in her life. And thus, we continue with Samantha, where she's doing, I don't remember what. She's sleeping. That's what she's doing. And Butterscotch is running in circles, as usual. Because Butterscotch doesn't know how to fucking chill and use her bed. She's such a tiny puppy! She's such a tiny puppy! What? She's so small. Look at, look at, look at, look at her. <laughs> Eating Chipotle? I love Chipotle. Sort of. Chipotle's okay, actually. I like them to an extent, but I've had better places, obviously. The Papilla! The Papilla's adorable! Except when the Papilla is destroying! What the hell are you ruining? What means? God frickin' damn it! How does she ruin the potted plants? They saw the gift of the sub to Assassin Cat one! And also a sub to RJ Has Kristen. It's better because Butterscotch sweet enough to eat. Butterscotch is a little less than adorable at the moment because Butterscotch is not being the perfect puppy. Butterscotch! We're gonna have to replace this plant when she wakes up. Twilight Onion! Oh my god, Lasana! Lasana gifted a sub to Halo Kibbles! <laughs> For three months. <laughs> Hi, Huggy! Butterscotch is always adorable. Butterscotch is our most adorable puppy who has four days left until she is no longer a puppy. We don't know what's gonna happen to Butterscotch when she grows up! Oh my god! Such a big step for such a little girl. Puppies are great. Puppies are perfect. And that is why Samantha had to get a puppy in her life. Come on. Come on. Come on. Actually, I think I need to. I never changed it. So, currently, the age settings are... Let's see. Seasons last for seven days, which is why everything's happening so quick. So, each season is lasting for essentially a week, which seems a little... Let's make them up to 12 days. Twilight Onion! Seven's a little insane. Um, I will get to that in a second. Lasada has gifted a sub to a toy, Brad! <laughs> oh my god, Brad. You've been gifted a sub, Lasada, you're being super sweet. 
Uh, enable weather. Yeah, we enable all the weather. I wanted to change... Where the hell is it? Uh, lifetime. Young adult, we're going to change to... 90 days. Adult will change to 90 days. Elder, that's fine. So, we're doing this... Just because nice. it'd be insane if we don't. Oh, I can change the lifespan of dogs and cats and such? Oh, look. We'll keep those for now. Because I feel like the 70 days was a little low. The sound I gifted another sub to Baron Kristin. Oh my god. And fucking gifted a sub to Miss Soulful Poet Cat. Pocky! You guys are being super sweet. What is wrong with both of you? <laughs> oh my god, wake up already! Do you have any dreams and aspirations? No, you're a puppy. You have no dreams and aspirations other than to become a dog. <laughs> Wait, what? What? Who are you? Oh. Who are you? It's Becky Rainey. What do you want, Becky? Why are you at the door, Becky? At 2.23 in the morning! Oh my god. Like, Mushroom. really. I don't know who this bitch is. For, I, I have a feeling it's probably a sub. I'm having a hard time keeping track of the subs because <laughs> it's the one that's making them. Mushroom. And there's so many coming through Ooh. because of Lasana. Um... <laughs> That honestly, I recognize the names of the people that I've seen all, uh, often in the chat, but <laughs> some of the newer people <laughs> that have been coming lately, um, it's gonna take me a little bit to remember some people. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm horrible. You may blame my <laughs> age on that. Yeah, subs get made into Sims. <laughs> Becky is with the good hair. Um, <laughs> yeah, any anyone who gets who subs ends up uh, going into the town. <laughs> Oh my god, Axel. Yeah, we're streaming Samantha early because we ended Couples Night early. So Samantha's gonna be going, oh my god, like three more hours. RJ has crested. I have no control over what Isaac makes you into because he's the one that's making the subs now. And let me tell you, some of them are interesting and other ones are tear-inducing. You can talk to Spyro about his sim. Sana is a sweetheart. One of us, one of us. <laughs> okay, Potato Queen. Let me put it this way. Because I told Isaac to use usernames for people, if your character appears in the town, I'm pretty sure I'm going to recognize the gay Potato Queen <laughs> as being a sub. It's when we get someone that's like Becky Rain. And then I get a sim that looks like EA could have had, like, stuck it in. Oh my god, you pedal on the front porch again! It's okay. This is what happens with puppies. Oh, she's awake! She's awake at 5.04 a.m. Oh my god, it's so early. Well, 5.04 a.m. Obviously, the first thing she needs to do is clean the house. Wait, what does she want to do here? Make the bed. She just did that. God damn it. What the hell was that noise? Uh, Chihuahua Choo Choo! Uh. Oh. The puddle's gone. Oh, she has nothing else to clean up. That's interesting. Okay, so... Have a quick meal. Uh, young lady, as we always, always, always have said, eats a dainty meal of green salad. Did I make your sim already? I believe your sim is in the game. I believe so. I didn't make it. That would be Isaac. I made a few Sims, but as Sims started, like, as subs started coming in, Isaac's been doing it, and Isaac likes the fact that I don't know what any of the subs mm. look like until we see them. And so he likes the chaos that ensues. Mm. Um, yeah, there's a list here, but I don't want to pull up the list right now. It's too much of a pain to go through it right now. I don't even know if the list, I think the list is up to date. It's not up to date on the subs, mm. 
That we're going to have to update the list on, but it is up to date with who's in the town. Yeah, Izik's been making dogs for people, and unfortunately the dogs and the cats are now having puppies and kittens. Like, they've exploded in puppies and kittens. So, oh my god, what does she have to do for her job again? She needs to up her painting skill. Uh, she has so much to focus on! Take a shower. And then continue. Actually, continue first, then take a shower. Samantha. Oh my god, Lasana, thank you for the bits! You have random bits. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what Izzik has did. What's a pain with Sims 3, honey? Will we ever have a sub showcase of who the Sims are? No, unfortunately, because it is such a pain. You guys see them as they pop up in the town, and I try to make a point of finding everyone at some point, if not more often. It's turning into the point where the subs are very quickly outnumbering the EA ones. And also, for those of you who have not been here before, this is not a typical town. This is one that I had found and downloaded, known as St. Clair. St. Clair is a really, really, really beautiful custom-made town. I had to sit here and go into this major large park and change it for the festivals, um, which took me a long time. But this town is completely custom-made by an individual. I've been having to edit certain things because they super designed it as if it was a... Uh, very realistic in its designs, and as a result, the Sims don't like moving around in a lot of areas, so I've had to change things. But, um, if you look at our VODs on YouTube, I think we have the link to where you can download um, St. Clair and some of the other custom content I've made. Custom content being along the lines of a portrait of, Sima of Angela, so that you can always remember what the Divine Designer did for you. This one is framed very tastefully in Samantha's apartment in the color of salmon. Oh my god! Answer it! You're not famous yet! It's hugging! No, stop it! <laughs> Just answer the phone! Talk to Huggy, I guess. Don't you dare ask her out on a date, Huggy. Huggy Crayola would like to chat. Does Samantha Pickering want to talk? No. <laughs> what? Huggy, what is wrong with you? It's like every single second you're all like, I need Samantha to redesign my house. <laughs> and then, and then, and then, and then, he's like, He's like, I need Samantha to redesign my house. And then in chat, he's screaming about what Samantha does to his house. Which is horrible. Don't you dare cry! Do you remember what your reaction was the last time she redesigned your home? You were angry! You better love your gym! Okay, we gotta, like, find a way to turn in that one thing. Let's see if she can actually finish this one in time. Look at this beautiful piece of art. Oh my god, it's raining. It's beautiful. This is gorgeous. This, this, this is a perfect representation of what a painting would be like if a kindergartner was making it. Don't get The Sims 4. Don't do it. Don't do it. Honestly, The Sims 4 seems like such crap compared to The Sims 3. Sims 3, even just the base game out of the box, you feel like you could do a lot more than in The Sims 4. Um, Sim, Sims 4, it makes it too easy to do things. Your Sim can meet someone on the street, talk to them, be friends, have sex with them, and suddenly marry them all in the same day. The Sims 3, you have to work for it. Like, you need to get them into certain moods, they have to know each other, certain things such as if you meet a Sim that has a commitment issues, they're really, really hard to get nailed down. She just completed a painting valued at 13 simoleons. Sell it for cash or drab it, drag it to the wall to hang it. No. We've got to name it. Oh, we have a uh, request, by the way. What? What request? Um, the painting name, art creature name for Pancat. What? For the, the rewards. Oh, okay. Pancat? Yeah. 
Pancat's Kittles. This is Pancat's Kittles. Pancat, if you ever wanted to know what your Kittles look like, it's like this. These are your Kittles. I think it's meant to be a car. There's a wheel. There's another wheel. I think that's a windshield. Oh my god, it's Angela's car! This is beautiful! Take it. No. The uh, rain effect, by the way, is really, really loud. I know it's really loud. I don't know why it's so loud, honestly. I don't know how to turn it down. Sound effects. Down. Music. It's muted. Ambient. Down. Audio quality. Up. Take it. Oh, whatever. There. Okay, I turned it down. <sighs> She's telling us what happened to her? No. Oh my god. Okay, let me see if I can turn down these a little bit more. Options. Sound effects. Go down a little bit more. A little bit more. Okay. That's a little better, I guess. It's beautiful! Oh my god. Hurry up! We need to find out what people need done in the town. We need to find out. We need to find out. You feel like all the mods make Sims 4 a lot better? The mods Yeah, the mods really shouldn't make a game better. Like, that's, that's really bad. I hate the fact that she always does that! What is this? The Greer household. Doesn't she have one to finish? That's the man cave. Like, there was one she finished, right? What happened to the one that she was supposed to have finished? Maybe it's this one? Let's, let's fix her hair first before it drives me nuts. I hate this hair. This is not your hair. This is not what you look like. You are changing your every day. It's not even a white clip. It's green. Oh, thank God. Oh my God. Thank God. Okay. Uh, let's visit the Greer house. Wait, the Greer? Who, who is this? Tana Poe needs a single ladies den? <laughs> no. Um, Melody Stewart needs an exterior makeover? No. Zaku Woodsington needs a teenage sanctuary. Why do you need a teenage sanctuary? Ever since the age of 11, my child has insisted on getting a brand new bedroom by the age of 13. I see no need to deny this request. After all, what my baby wants, my baby gets. Okay, Zaku. But I'm going to go here. I've accepted the assignment. No, don't yet. I, I need to see... Jobs available. How do I how do I see? How do I see what I had? Frick. Frick. Majestic Messin, thank you for the follow. Uh I'm gonna go here because I have a feeling that this is it. Okay, let's go here. Butterscotch, you take care. Samantha has to go and spread salmon to the world. That's a beautiful color. Even her umbrella is the color of salmon. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Man cave. Yeah, I can do this one. What the hell happened to the house that she had done? It's like it glitched out. <clears throat> so in order to get the houses to look like this and the gardens to look like this, you have to use the cheat uh, move objects on. Otherwise, you can't get the things to fit properly, but it also makes the gardens look most realistic. The only time I think I'll end up cheating in the game or using the cheats will be to make the gardens, because they look way better when you can have things overlapping a little. Um, other, other than that, though... This camera's going crazy. Other than that, the uh, having the camera... Using any of the cheats really kind of makes the game boring. So I don't use them. 
She was waiting for clients to get out of the way so she, they, so that she could start working. Get on the porch then! You're already looking and going, why is it wet? Uh, I, I, that's not dignified. What the hell? Samantha! Samantha! This is not a dignified look! I guess she's perfectly having fun. Samantha, this is not how you- What the fuck is going on with the tongue? Look at the tongue. It's like going through her lip. Samantha, Samantha, oh. Sam Wait, what? There we go. This is not what you do. This is not a dignified thing to do. Don't do that again. <laughs> this is not dignified. Can we begin the renovation already? Well, she's getting wet just like waiting here for the frickin' renovation! Giuseppe Huston? Jason Kilpatrick? You guys gonna like just wait? I also have a feeling that uh, Oni lives here. We haven't seen Oni B yet. We've seen Oni B's uh, dog Doge. Doge is everywhere. Can't see. See, this is what we're talking about. Okay, so as gorgeous as these setups are, because this is what the person ended up making, they made really, really, really beautiful rooms. This is not normal. <laughs> Like, you're, you can't place a chair here like this normally. So they use the move objects sheet to do this kind of stuff. But it looks so pretty! You have to remove it. Yeah, I know. So the problem is, if Samantha does anything and I don't remove or fix anything that's been done like that, um, chances are the client is going to say that they can't interact with the object and as a result it's worthless and they can't use it. So like this... See, I like these counters, but these counters here make this wall impossible to use. So we have to get rid of it. I, I like these too. It's really sad. Oh, what are these? Just hutches? I think we can keep these as is because those are just viewable items. But this chair... Needs to go. Actually, I don't know if it does. Hold on. If we can move it and move it back, then we're fine. Nah, we can move it here. It's fine there. Okay, so it's 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 fine there. This what? It's kind of cool. I like that. I'm gonna keep that. Um, but this chair definitely can't survive. Uh, this should be... This is a door here! There's a freaking front door here! No! Why? You don't get this room. This is not a room that you get to have in your life. Get out of here. Oh, god damn it. Hold on. <laughs> Stop it. There. Oh my god. This is this is absolutely horrible. This is this is horrible. What is with this camera angle? Camera! Stop it! Okay, let's do this. Okay, yeah, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. I honestly don't know if this bookcase is fine, I'm pretty sure it's okay. Um uh, uh, Um Kitchen. How does the kitchen look? Kitchen looks normal. It's fine. Second floor. What does he? What does he want? He wants a man cave. So he wants an expensive TV, a sofa, a foosball table, a living chair, like this. This room here totally doesn't need all this crap. Like all of that makes this super not okay. That can normally go there, so we're fine with that. 
Um, this, this, this can go here. Because I don't have the cheat on, but if you hold Alt, you can move things around in whatever way you want to make it look good. And if you can place it, then you're, you're okay to place it. And if it's a decorative object, you're pretty much okay. Let's see. Like, like, look. Why? 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 What? Just why? Why? The sun has gifted a sub to Grimace 44! Thank you for the gifted sub! Also, too, um, it's Sayorak, which I didn't acknowledge before, I'm sorry. Thank you for the gifted subs! Asana's going crazy. She's insisting that everyone needs to be in this town. She's not wrong. Okay, I think we're okay. So he wants an expensive TV. I can't freaking. You can't. Why do you need an expensive TV? For a man cave? Do you really need an expensive TV for a man cave? Okay. So obviously, the man cave needs to. Wait, what is this outside? What the fuck is this? Do you want your man cave to be this? No, we don't want to build. You need expensive TV, a sofa, a foosball table, a living chair. Okay, we're gonna get rid of all the offending crap. This is going. Get rid of the sectionals. Get out of here. Get out of here. We don't need this piece of crap. Or any of this. We have a beautiful budget to work with. Like, we don't need this. You don't need- this is not a man cave material. You don't have a china cabinet and say man cave. No. Never. This- this is meditative. This is not man cave material. It needs like a football. This TV, not expensive enough. Get out of here. This rug isn't pretty enough either. Get out. Okay. This is gonna be in the man cave. This. Alright. So, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to do this. First of all, get rid of this. No, no, stop that. We're gonna get rid of this. Okay, we're gonna make one fantastic man cave. And also, Lissana gifted a sub to consider 513 and a Grimace 44. Oh my freaking god, Lissana. Water. Okay. First things first. We need to fix the curtains. Maybe after we fix the walls. The walls... This is pretty obvious, actually. I mean, Thalman is the only way to go. We need Thalman. This, this, no. Thalman. Beautiful. Thalman. There we go. This Thalman. This Thalman. Hold on, Thalman. There we go, that's Thalman. Okay, we're gonna have Thalman, and then this is gonna be blue. It's beautiful. It's gonna be gorgeous. Did you, can you, can you change sometime soon? Thank you. Oh my god, Lestana gifted another sub to Ab Amy Zimmer and Gwendolyn2013! What would you ask, is it Ben Masai? Oh my god. Salmon. It's beautiful. Just, we gotta make this match with this one. It's, these, these are beautiful colors, and you guys need to understand that these are beautiful colors. This room isn't gonna be perfectly designed by her, but she's touching it. That's what's important. It's blow. Make it blow. Let's make it beautiful and blue. It's gorgeous. And then these, we're gonna live on the edge with these tiles, okay? I have some green going on in here. Yes. Oh God, yes. Oh yes. That's perfect. Oh yeah. Okay, we're gonna leave it like that. It's just beautiful. It's gorgeous. We're just gonna leave that. Okay. 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 Now that we know where this is going, now that we know where this is going, we can deal with the lighting. 
We actually kind of like this light. Let's keep the light. We can save some money. We currently have a very, very nice budget of 13000 No. What? We have, no, I'm sorry. We have a nice budget of 18000 If only we had had that budget for Huggy's life. We could have, like, solved so much. How much does the big TV cost? Let's find out. Da, da, da. No, get the TV. We need 12000 for this. This seems appropriate. Ah, oh, yeah. Man cave material. Yes. Yes. We're gonna make this golden orange. Mm-hmm. Yep. With blue trim. Here, no, teal. We're gonna make teal trim with salmon. And then this part will be golden orange. It's beautiful. Oh my god, Asana gifted another sub to Just Bay! Thank you for the gifted subs, Asana. We're gonna. Okay, that's it. It's beautiful. Look, the speakers kind of match the curtains, and that's what we wanted. This is beautiful already. Okay, the flooring we're not gonna change because we're gonna change the flooring through rugs because that's exactly how you end up designing things properly. We need a sofa! But we also need a foosball table. Can I get a sofa in the form of like the sectional sofas? Because that was kind of cool. Let's do some more sectionals, yeah? How do I do sectionals? Miscellaneous comfort. Look, sofa. Sofa. Oh, this does count. Yes! Okay, so we're gonna make this into our masterpiece. But we have to make sure that it matches the proper color scheme. Okay, first things first, salmon. Oh, yes! Ah! Oh. Too much. White. But the bottom part, salmon. More salmon. Here we go. Okay. So we got some Thalman on top of Thalman. And then this part can be just beautiful. Beautiful. No, Thalman. Okay, yas. Yas! It's beautiful. Okay. Okay. Um. Actually, it's missing something. You know what it's missing? It's flowers. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Hold on. Let's see. Isn't there a nice. Modern-esque flower pattern. What is this? Oh my word. Oh. Oh my. How about that? What about this one? So if we can do that. Yes. It's perfect. Okay, we're gonna do this. Here we go. This is this is beautiful. Man cave! Man cave for every man! Oh yeah! This is a man cave for only a sp special man. Oh. Oh, we got him, Leviosa. Okay, let's do that. Okay. It wants a living chair now here, too, and a stereo. What the frick do they want out of life? Like, seriously. It's like, can you be a little less demanding? I mean, she's trying to make your life perfect. Here, get rid of this. We're gonna get rid of this. What is this god-awful travesty here? Get rid of this. Okay. And then this... It's gonna come in here a little bit more. Ah, oh, yes. There we go. It's perfect. It's perfect. Your little sister's being annoying. Lock her in a closet, but don't tell anyone I told you to do that. Isaac's gonna be very angry at me. Actually, he doesn't care right now. He's just doing his own thing. <laughs> I'm working on talking to people about The Sims and the title cards for all the stream bots. I'm also listening to the also listening to the streams and talking back to people about their characters. Are you okay? But I'm not doing anything. No. Nothing. Honey, I love you. I love you. Yes, you do. You can't stop it. You can't deny it. How beautiful this is. I'm gonna put this here. No, why? Why? 
Why won't this let me put this here? Damn it. Never mind. Okay, we need a foosball table. Entertainment. What if she's already in the closet? Uh, that's a problem. Is this a gay man man cave? Yes? I mean, I guess. Does it have to be? Are you saying that only gay men can have flowers and salmon? Is that what you're saying? Because that's a little, like, presumptuous of you and just a little bit homophobic. Because I think all men need to embrace the colors of salmon and the beauty of flowers. I'm trying to find the fucking foosball table. Thunder Sporting Goods. Found it. There we go. So when you need to play foosball, you play it right here. Okay. Here, nice get rid room. of this. Perfect. You don't need much of a couch here. Now, let's go back. Go back. Go back. Put it back. Put it back. Put it back. Because we need a living chair in here still. We're going to put one right here. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going to get a living chair. One living chair. Um. <laughs> Did you hear gay? <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. We need... We need a Samantha original. We need a Samantha original. Hold on. This will be a Samantha original. First of all, this is hideous. I don't care what anyone thinks. This is hideous. We need to change this. So it's gonna be gold. Mark gold. It's beautiful. It's just Mark gold. Okay, it's beautiful. It's gorgeous. The song you have to sub the Dixity goal! And basic and board followed. Thank you for the follow. And thank you for the sub! And it's just gonna be more beautiful teal. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hold on. Let's, let's make this. No. Gotta get a slightly lighter color. No, it's gonna be this one. Here we go. And then this. Gold. Okay. Beautiful. Okay. And then we need a stereo in here. What needs? He needs a stereo. And she, he needs a stereo. It's not a gift at another sub to Nightlight 2020. Why? So many subs. Not that I'm complaining. <laughs> Super sweet of you. Oh my god. We spent most of our budget. Okay. So we're running low on the budget money. Okay. We get it. We get it. We get it. So we need a proper stereo. Here. You don't here. Here this is just what is this? I don't know what that is. What is this? God, this is hideous. Miscellaneous. White. Okay, you're perfect. You fit in now. It's fine. Okay. Let's see. Oh, you know what else doesn't fit in is this. Hold on. Let's see this the budget dilly. What about the budget? The budget's fine. Changing things up like this is fine. It's beautiful. Wait, this part? Salmon. <gasps> no. A lighter salmon. It's beautiful. What about this whole thing? What the frick is this for? It's fine. Just leave it as it is. Okay. 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 We need a stereo and we need rugs. And we need designer stuff. Hold on. So first things first. What is this? Is this pan cat? No, it's something else. It's a grading card. This is pan cat's kennels! It's perfect in here! It's beautiful. I just want you guys to realize. Oh no, I hit F1. Hold on, I gotta continue the renovation. Hold on. Gotta continue it. Continue. She's not done. Uh, ready, yeah, that's why you have. A, a... <laughs> oh my god, just freaking use umbrella. No, just. Oh my god. Continue! Because these two can't stop loving each other, one of them just popped out of existence. 
Oh my. One of them just stopped existing. If you don't see a man sucking another man's dick, you don't want to be part of this town. There's probably plenty of man sucking man dick in here. There are gay couples. Uh, I'm we're the second. I'm the second streamer the puppy has ever watched. Ooh, a puppy! It's appropriate. Hold on. Gotta gotta work on this room. Just hold on. You gotta give it. First of all, we're gonna have to give. We have to get a stereo. So a stereo comes first and foremost. What the hell is this here for? We need to get a stereo in here for this kind of crap? Oh my god. Fine. What is this? Big Daddy Sound Attire. It's a piece of crap is what it is. This is an old, old stereo. What about this? It's vinyl. What about this? You know what we need? We need this, not this. Get out. Get, get. Can't intercept. It's this. Oh my god. We'll, we'll fix the stereo, don't worry. And right now it's clashing, but that's fine. That's why we do this. That's why we say salmon. Oh my god, it's so beautiful! What is with this table? This table does not match. What is with these chairs? Ugh. Hold on. The top of the table could be tiled. Yes. No. It's white. It's white. It's just white. It's 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 IKEA white. That's what it is. It's beautiful. There you go. Come on. Update. Thank you. We're gonna do this. This entire room needs to match. We know plenty about what this person wants. And what this person wants is Samantha's perfections as Samantha ends up seeing it. Trevor Greer. Let's see. Um, decor. Rugs. He's probably going to honestly hate this. And he's probably going to end up hating it because there's something I missed that's blocking something else. And it's going to really upset me. We're going to have to deal with it. That's beautiful. We're going to keep that. And Thalman. Deeper Thalman. Yes. Beautiful. Yes. Yes. They're gonna do it. Sure. Except we're gonna take this because it's such a beautiful design, and we're gonna put it right here. Yes. So beautiful. Man cave. This is a manly man cave. We still have some money left. Hold on. So, man cave. An appropriate man cave has to have an appropriate male figure. Something that screams manly men. Yes. Yes. Damn it. Hold on. What we don't need is this. What we need is this. An appropriate show of beauty and power. Yes. Mushroom. Yes. But we have to change this. Your eyes do not hurt from the rugs. Your eyes hurt from the fact that your room doesn't look this magnificent. Your home could be this beautiful. But it's not. Alright, change them. Oh, no. It's gotta go this way. Actually, no. Let's go this way. And then this. Let's see. Hold on. It's like a lighter gold. Yes! Oh my god. It's perfect. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yes! Can we change this to so where it has? Cannot change style. It's fine. It's beautiful as it is. It's beautiful as it is. Turn in the renovation. Sammy girl needs a reality check. Excuse you! She is perfect! And you only wish you could be as perfect as her. Yorb! Yorb Homa Legrand! See, I'm pretty sure. 
that straight men don't look like this. This is Jason Kilpatrick. And this is Giuseppe Huston. With the best... What the, what the hell is it? bleach. Ah! Have a knot! Boodle! Plastic! How dare you! I always forget the very first one. Sure to wash. I did not put in the bleach. We need, we need, and excuse you, it's not bleach. It's refreshments. No. No. We are going to fix this. We have time. We have time. Okay. It's okay, everyone. It's okay. It's okay. We, I, I, I didn't remember, but Isaac reminded me, probably because he saw that someone else said it. It's fine, okay. So, for those of you who are wondering, Samantha is the perfect hostess, and as a result, in every single one of the homes that she designs, she has to leave for them a reminder that when your guests come over, you must always have refreshments available. This makes a nice cocktail. It's beautiful. Let's see. Somebody said you can change the um, the default paint, uh, color of them. Of what? So you don't have to change the color every single time. I did. I didn't change the color of it every time. But there's certain things that I don't want to like have a default changed. Jeez. I need to. Hold on. We're gonna do this. It's perfect. There. I love color theory and so does Samantha. I mean, who the hell doesn't love theorizing about the thousand and one uses of something? It, it's beautiful. See, Nay? This is the glorious Samantha. Who's designed this? We don't need any supposed criticisms. I mean, she's the designer. No one else here is. Alright. She's perfection. I like how she just waits in the rain. She's soaking. But she's gonna wait in the rain. Don't worry. 1001 Uses of Thalman reaches number one on New York Times bestsellers list. Oh my god, yes! Salmon. It's beautiful. Is this who we need to talk to? Who is this? Trevor Greer. Did you make the Greer family? I can't remember. I think so. She's 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 having issues talking to him. We have to walk up his driveway just to talk to him, don't worry. It's perfect! Observe Zorks. Steve. Zampies. Zorka? <laughs> Salmon is a glorious color, and it has 1,001 uses, as is being observed and showcased by Samantha every single time she redesigns a home. Let's observe. Oh my god, the TV is magnificent! Oh, and he loves the painting. He loves the painting. You can't see when I do that. And he loves the foosball. Ah, uh, he's kind of weird looking because he's a werewolf, and that's fine. That's fine. Samantha's a little turned on by the supernatural, even though he has a penis and not a vagina. Samantha is a wonderful girl who is madly in love with a woman because she happens to like vaginal slits, not penises. The tree trunks do not satisfy Samantha. The holes do. Is it's just ignoring me? <laughs> he's he's probably honestly gonna sit there and say that he, I don't want to think about. He's probably gonna say he doesn't like it because of something in the house. Yeah, there's something in the house that's clashing somewhere. Overall, I think you did a terrible job. You cluttered things up quite. It's really hard to do this job in this town because of that. Um, 
Um, and Tuna Tuna six two nine resub for two months. Thank you for the resub. Oh. <sighs> so what the hell did he end up is not working? I bet it's this. I bet the chair is one. I should have double checked that chair. The toilet is clipping in the wall a little bit as well. No, it's not. I'm looking at the toilet right now. It's not. Toilets are. F oh, the other toilet can't be used. This toilet here is not usable by The Sims yeah. because they can't fit. Damn it! Yeah, this entire room is worthless. The shower needs to be removed, and if that shower is removed, then everything works. <sighs> no, it's it's not anything that I placed. It's the other stuff. Like, if you look at this, a sim can't make use of the shower or this toilet properly. And I think that's what the, end of the problem is. And because those are a problem, he considers the entire job to be crap no she's gotten good reviews it's usually in a house that i catch everything on but the going is going to be slow for her because as see she has to use it let's see can she use it no she's using the toilet it looks like she couldn't use it but she can use it and she's all like i'm depressed so i'm gonna go shit in your toilet why not have a shower bath combo? I don't know, because whoever originally designed St. Clair decided to design some of these homes the way they did. There's probably something slightly in the wall. What is Butterscotch doing? Sniffing around. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Answer the phone. Let's see who it is. This has not been a very good day for her. Deliver a painting to Egypt. An Egyptian relic tycoon wants to buy a painting from you, but insists that it will be hand-delivered to Al-Simhara. There will be a nice compensation for your trouble. Deliver a painting worth more than... Okay. Maybe. I don't think she'll be able to... Oh, it needs to be worth 750 oh, She's not going to do that anytime soon. Okay. Let's go and visit the Wizington household. It's only 3.12 p.m. in the day. She has plenty of time. Those bath curtains, though, they're pretty! Is she sweating? No. She's wet from the rain. It's sad. Oh, my. Manchu Mablanco. For why? Ma, Denis. People are so angry. Goodbye, Butterscotch. Samantha's got another job to do. Is Chrism in the park again? She keeps showing up in the park playing kids at chess. Oh. We took the taxi over to this corner lot so we could run all the way over here to take the subway to where we need to go. Because <laughs> that's what she does. She's going to get lost in Egypt like Angela in Paris. No! No, she dare! Horrible. She's not well Save enough enough yet. What? It's not gonna make a difference right now. Save the game. No. Oh. I haven't gotten over the fact that Angela was lost to us. Oh, it's a good it is. It's Solaro. It's Solaro de Villas. Hi, Solaro. Gay potato queen, but be better look super potatoey. And gay. I just want you to know that. Who's this? Who's this? Who do we have over here? This is Tier Denkero. Oh my god, what the hell? And this is Cody Bookworm. Mm -hmm. The borrow. Cody Bookworm, this is what you look like! The frick? This is like super slut outfit number nine. Oh my god. Really? Really? Oh. Uh, no. Go. <laughs> Samantha, run. Um, this is also part of St. Clair that I love so much was these little brownstone type apartments. They're so cute. This entire area. Who are they? Who is this? Baby wolf cub, I don't know what happened to your hair. Oh, you're in werewolf form. I don't know what happened to you, period. 
There, that's baby wolf cub in werewolf form. <coughs> this is Cherubeth Whittington. Hello, Cherubeth. You're quite dapper, even though your outfit's very weird. Is it, like, made you really weird looking? I can't control the outfit. What, did she change it? Yeah, that's not what, she, what I gave her. Here. Oh. That's pretty much what Baby Wolf Cub is wearing, except she doesn't have her little thing on her head, but that's because she's a werewolf right now. <laughs> oh. Oh. Your sim is probably a zombie right now. It's true, Path Leader. It's probably true. So on the plus side, this home looks pretty bare bones, which is really good for us because it means it's probably not going to have any problems to be made. So we need a teenage sanctuary uh, for an 11 year old. So we're going to have to turn this room into a sanctuary for a teenager. Yes. That's what we're going to do. Scary bears, berries, fairy. What? What is with these, these bears? I never quite understood these bears in this game. Uh, we need a single or a double bed, a dresser. Well, none of this gets work. Say goodbye to childhood! Ugh. Okay. Okay. Samantha knows what kids really want. Okay. We're gonna say she doesn't redo the floors because it's way too much work. And we don't like dealing with work like that. So the first thing's first. Salmon. Of course we're doing Salmon. Yeah, we're doing lighter shade Salmon. Okay. But, I want you all to remember, this is a child's room. Not just a child's room, a teenager's room. We need to be appropriate for them. I lied, we're doing the floor. Doing the floor. It's perfect. Don't come into my room colors. Yeah. What if the kids are colorblind? Um, then they won't have any problems and they'll just have to feel the salmon coming off the walls to them. I mean, it's not possible for you to not feel the salmon. Okay? You have to understand that. So we need these curtains. Is that the right curtains? What do we have? We don't have a huge budget. So we have to work with what we got. So we're going to put these guys up. And we're going to do this. It's beautiful. Super beautiful. Yes. Salmon. It's beautiful. This is going to be... Metals. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. We got this. It's beautiful. Oh, oops. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> uh, Samantha's special homemade wallpaper also has the lush texture of real salmon. Yes. It doesn't have just the lush, lush texture of real salmon, but every morning you will wake up to the fresh and luscious smell of fresh salmon. It triggers every morning as the sun comes up. We're making a true child's bedroom. It's a true teenager's paradise. Salmon. So we need a single or a double bed. That's easy. We will first get a single bed. Because children don't need double beds. Because all that's going to do is make them want to screw. Because kids don't know how to not do that. So we have to make sure they remain pure. Isaac's very, very concerned about me right now. What? Child's bedroom. Why did you look at me like that, honey? Honey. Her. Excuse you? You're a kook. No. We need a dresser in here. We also need a desk somehow. We need to somehow fit a dresser and a desk in here. Hold on. Okay. Dresser. Uh, give the team one of those anti-masturbation crosses they have to be strapped to when they sleep. 
Well, that's what this bed is for. This bed is to remind them that they are slowly sinking into the depths of hell as they learn to, like, understand their bodies. That's exactly how this works. So the dresser. No. That just says vanity. We don't believe in that. Here. You're gonna have a nice, simple, sane dresser. Made of Thalman. 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 No. There we go. Metals. Need golden handles. Yes. Yes. Oh, God. What did I do? Ugh. Yes. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. I need a bookshelf in here, too? What the fuck kind of room do they need? This isn't a child sanctuary. This is you giving in to the demands of one really spoiled brat. God! Do you know what I didn't get to do when I was growing up? Go up to my parents and say, I demand a new bedroom, mommy and daddy. And then have a new bedroom magically appear. But apparently Zaku just does that. Here, we're gonna have a cheap ass desk. No, that's, that's too cheap. Here, it's just this one. This is cheap. But we shall co color it the color of a child's soul. It's beautiful. Gorgeous. Oh my god. Oh my god. So while you guys are contemplating the soul and the death and destruction that this child's presence is leaving on this bedroom, I have to go use the bathroom. And this is going to be very upset. He already is upset. I don't have a BRB screen. You know what my BRB screen looks like? It looks like this right now. It's not anything. <laughs> so please... Listen to the wonderful sounds of Animal Crossing as Isaac like holds his head in his hands, Are and I'll be serious? right back. Yes, I'll be right back.
You were fucking god. Gonna kill him. Gonna freaking kill you, honey. Ah! Yes, I was getting up to avoid deadly blood clots as well. See, this is important. This desk is vanishing. <laughs> like the soul of a child. <laughs> so we're gonna have to do this. Ah, now it stands out. Yes. Yes. Yes, okay, so we have a desk. We don't have a table. We don't have a, we don't have a chair for the desk, but that's fine. Because I don't think we are required to supply a chair, but we're gonna give a chair anyways. It's gonna be a broke ass chair because it's a child, it's a teenager. You don't deserve a real chair. You have this one. There. And just to make sure it looks like your mommy and daddy couldn't buy you a proper chair and you had to come up with this on your own, it's green. None of it matches. It's green. There. Freaking, oh my god. I need two living chairs. What the frick am I gonna do with two living chairs? <sighs> Here, you just want a desk and now you want living chairs. Fine, we'll do that. Let me see, what, what can I do as far as living chairs? These Do these count as living chairs? No. It's just, just freaking Bobby. Stop it! I don't remember how to turn this off. The studio mode. There we go. What? I love you. Don't look hurt. No. Stop it. No, baby. Don't do that. This. See, this doesn't even work. Honey. Hi. I guess this works as a chair. But this isn't a real chair that works. You want a kiss on the cheek? Okay. Ah, it doesn't even fit. I can't give you a kiss on the cheek right now. Can you come over here? Why? What am I giving chairs here for? What am I, like seriously, why does this, why do they need chairs? Saku, I don't know what you ended up doing as far as this kid was concerned, but you should have just told them that they don't get to have anything that they want. Because now, I am making the house into this ugly, disgusting mess! Do you want to know why? Because these kids don't fucking know what to do! Oh wait, we gotta... Here, let's get some lighting in here. Let's figure out what we're doing properly. Okay. Here. I guess. We can't leave any room untouched properly. Here we go. It's, it, it works. It works. Don't worry. It works. Because we need to fit chairs in here. Okay? Chairs. Cheap ass chairs. This kid is never gonna fucking use. Oh my god. Stop it. Kiss. Stop it, game! It's like slowly rotating. It's all like, I, I can't. Okay. Blue. Just, that's not a very good blue. There, there, that's a good blue. That's a good blue. Yes. Th these kind of blues are the kind of blues that reach into our soul. That remind us why we play games like this. And why we don't put chairs with the desk like you would think we're supposed to. Because fuck that shit. That's why. Because, ultimately, we're gonna get a bookshelf and we're gonna fit it somewhere. Where are we fitting this bookshelf? Here, have, have this. No, let's... We're gonna put the bookshelf over here, I guess. We have this cheap-ass book... Oh my god! No! Absolutely not. This room is not meant to look like this. Here. There we go. It's beautiful. Okay. <sighs> Finally a chair that fits a large sitter. Yes! 
and breaks their ass all at the same time due to its uncomfortableness. That's exactly the kind of chair that we want. We have 2,040 simoleons left for this stuck up little prick of a child. Don't worry. We'll make sure that they get the most of their money. <laughs> 1,000. I can't fit it. What this one? No, it's ugly. What this one? It's got a squirrel on it. No. They don't deserve it. How about this one? What is this? Oh my god, to remind you of your childhood? No, it's gone. Your childhood's gone. No. It's ugly. Here. Because you were a spoiled child and don't deserve anything nice. We're giving you the cheap-ass bookcase. The cheap-ass bookcase. For every child who no one really loves. Despite what their parents may tell you. Oh, yeah, i just put this here. I know I wasn't going to, but we're going to put this here. No. Just freaking... Like, seriously. Who the hell needs these chairs in this room? Why do you need these chairs? Here. We're going to take this color. I'm going to put it over here. The spoiled little brat needs something to drink. Oh, that's true. You're absolutely right. The first salmon. There we go. Mushroom. Every child needs to learn early on. And Ginger Snaps, thank you for the follow. Also, Ginger Nut Store, thank you for the follow 11 minutes ago and I totally didn't say. This child needs to learn early that everyone deserves a little bit of hospitality. Just, just, just. <gasps> we can put it up here. It's like the illicit drink that we don't just give out to everyone. But it's there, in case we need it. Illicit drinks. For all the children. No, you don't get this. The one plant is the reminder that there is a little bit of hope left in your soul that's slowly being crushed alive. Let's see. You have 1,800 left. What can we buy that's disgustingly expensive? Here, this, this lamp is... It's not super disgustingly expensive, but this lamp works. Here, get this lamp. It's nice. Okay. Now... Can we get you, like, penance because you're a child? You're a teenager? Teenagers? No, you know what? Teenagers require toiletries. Their overhead light is just a light bulb. Yeah, so? They're a teenager. Their life is empty and meaningless, just like that life bul light bulb. Did you want me to fix that or something? Did you? Everything in moderation. Alcohol. Yes. Just reminded the kid why mommy and daddy drink on a daily basis. Yes. Oh, yeah. 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 This is what we're doing. It's perfect. This is, they can start young and early. It's fine. Hold on. Let's find something else that we can give them. Here. For those long nights. When you've had just one too many faps. Samantha thinks of everything and everyone. It's not appropriate, is it? We need a toilet paper roll instead. Hold on. We got this. Here we go. That's too low. Damn it! Can we just get a box of tissues on the floor or something? No. No, we can't. Fine. There we go. But we'll color it to be appropriate, okay? Oh my god, we can put... Oh my god, oh, it's gross! Salmon. <laughs> there we go. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. DON'T JUDGE ME! It's beautiful. And also, every kid... Every kid... 
does not matter who they are. They love not only Samantha Originals, but Once in a Blue Moon. Once in a Blue Moon. We will understand their inner turmoil and give them an Angela Original. I need to I need to flip this around. Can you can you? Come on, come on. Yeah, it's close enough. It's it's just not rotating like I wanted to. <sighs> Whatever. It's, a, it's an Angela original. It's for that emo child. Okay? When, when, when homework becomes too tough, they can let out their inner aggression. There you go. It's beautiful. Let's turn this in. It's just, it's a one time, one time, she was inspired by the divine designer. <gasps> Oh, dare not we Shut up, Cherubeth! <laughs> Baby Wolf, come stop scratching your ass! Eep, Norba, do. We love talk. Congratulations, you sold items worth 16 simoleons. You've been charged one simoleon on consignment fees. Here's a summary of some of your top selling items today Iron. Oh, it's Rahim O'Connell. Oh, Rahim, you're just a glorious individual. You don't look like you'll never get laid. Uh. Oh. What? What? What kind of... What, what kind of memory is that he just had? Saku, come home. This is important. Yeah, the... No, the knives are there to trim the plants. It's also there for ah, children that happen to come in the room. Best. I mean, uh, gotta give them something to play with. That was the whole original design concept. So now you have refreshments and toys for people that come over who have not learned to become adults uh, instead of just children. Choo -choo. <laughs> uh, yes. Being a teenager is a transitional phase. Makana? She's feeling anxious oh. about the faucet. <laughs> oh my god. Can you just freak out? No. Apparently freaking out is really, really good for Sims that are neurotic, as she is, because, I mean, being perfect is a little bit neurotic at times. It's almost six. Oh my god, please not let have the... Zaku, here's Zaku. Oh my god, honey, did you change the outfit, or is this Zaku? He's just wearing all types of bracelets. Flexnor! He's right there, play. Samantha. <laughs> Isaac's giving me a creepy look. This is not Zaku's normal outfit. The Sims all went around and changed their outfits. Who the hell is this? And why are you standing here all creepily? Jennifer. Jennifer, what are you doing? Stop it. She's all like, I need to be here. Sika. Actually, is. Oh, 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 oh. Let's, let's see. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Uh, Samantha! Samantha! Uh, we have a chance! We have a chance of a great rating! Uh, Except for Baby Wolf Cup going crazy. Wait, who's this? Bowie. Bowie! Why is Bowie here? Does, is Sadie living with the Whizzington family? Bowie's there eating. Oh wait, no, that's Cine, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Bowie's here. Cine, Bowie. Here's Bowie. This is Bowie. Yeah, Bowie. This is Bowie. Cine's pissed off. Overall, I think you did a good job. It turned out it's fine. It's not amazing, but I can't complain too much. Samantha earned 250 simoleons, including a 50 simoleon bonus. Yes, take the photo now. She needs to take the photo now. What? 
take a photo of her. It's beautiful. <laughs> what are you what are you having a what are you having a moment with, honey? Mushroom. You've discovered a new photo collection called Home Sweet Home. What? Why did his dick say cute cat? What? <laughs> when you went to his dick, it said cute cat for the photo. <laughs> but we must have been under him. Oh. Oh, hold on. Camera. Photo. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Sim in the area, everyday moments. Can you get your alerts off? Television. No. Because it's doing an announcement, but you're not saying anything. Kiss your link yeah. has followed. Thank you for the follow! One minute ago. I don't. Actually, I didn't hear. I don't think I heard that one. It right. went off. I heard it. Uh oh. No, the the alerts are now attached to OBS Studio. It can't yeah, be. no, I heard it through the stream. You're just deaf. <laughs> I'm deaf. I'm paying attention to the cute cats. Get out of there before the Zaku has talked your ear off. Leave! You know what she's going to do? We're going to see about... Let's see. She still needs to be known. She can visit Spooky Day. What is this? Visit St. Clair Stadium. There must be best in show competition. Bachelor Stadium. What is this? Police Department. Carlos Diner Station. No. Bruja House. Where is she right now? Oh, she's right there. Okay. So we have options on places we can go to. What is she in need of? She's hungry. Brunton's Boxcar Diner. That sounds hideous. Let's go to the Brujajas. Wait, Brujajas? Where's the rainbow connection? Because it's beautiful. Kensington Green, Theatre Royale, Park Avenue Health Club. Ugh. What is this one? Just Club Occult? Stop it. Receive a great review. Okay. Meet a vampire. Ooh, let's go to Club Occult. Visit Club Occult. Oh wait, better yet. Don't go home. Visit Club Occult with... Now. Now. Visit Club Occult. Let's go to Club Occult. Let's see what happens here. She has like no money to her name. She's got 1,000 simoleons. Bowie's fine. Oh, Goodbye, Bowie. Bowie's underage. You will see. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let's wait for this to load up a little bit because that's a little insane. She like ran down here and there's like nothing going on. What is this? Collect it. All we hear is ex magical explosions. Why are there magical explosions everywhere? What did save she collect? Me. What? It's gonna take fucking forever to save! Do you want it to crash and everything again? No! I need more water. If only my carafe could get filled. If only someone cared about my giraffe. Tiger. Tiger kitty! He woke up. He's looking all bleary. Tiger kitty. It's so hard being you. you. Just sleep. And then stretch and sleep. Look around to see if Bodhi's trying to kill you. Sleep some more. Stretch. Sleep some more. Why is Bowie in someone else's house? Because you probably moved into the basement. Yeah, the basement's a separate apartment. Yeah, the basement's like a separate apartment of sorts. Even though it's not a separate apartment. You still live with the family. But, you probably live in the basement. Let's be real. Tiger. Multiple saves help with corrupt files. 
Well, I try to back up the saves, but I haven't done it in like two streams, so I need to back up the saves after today. No, honey. You know what we need to do? We need to work on getting the wife in the house. She's like in love with what's her name? Corin, Corinne, Carolyn, Carol. I'm pretty sure it started with a C. But she has a love interest in her life, and maybe it's about time that Samantha settle down and have that perfect married life. I mean, it's soon. It's early. Don't get me wrong, but. She believes in perfection, wherever it is. What's her name again? Corey. 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 Phoenix! Wolf, use the 100 bits. Thank you for the bits! She just found some iron. It's valued at 14 millions. Hold on. What else is around here? Anything? It's just, it's just Club Occult. Nothing else here. No, oh, look at this. Collect that. Ugh, -choo -choo. Shut up. Okay, let's let's order food. Ugh, Why is she having problems? Like, she just needs to go in, order food, single serving of. None of these are salads. A shrimp cocktail, I suppose. Oh. It's close enough. It's fine. Are you serious? There's something in the way that prevents her from actually going inside? That can't be true. She's complaining about a table or something. Hold on. Something's bugging with her ability to enter, and that's really, really annoying. Can she not go in? Go here. She can't go in. She, can she not go in because she's not a member of the occult? What? What? She's denied? What kind of weird ass. You know what? You know what? One day she vows to purchase this place and to wreck it off the map. It's. It's. It shouldn't be gated. I mean, there's a door right here, and she can't even click on it to go inside. Go here. Ugh, yeah, she Eva. can't go in for some weird Ugh. reason. I don't know. Is it, like, closed to anyone who's not a member of the of Supernatural? Uh, it's Venge's in here! Why is Venge here? Venge is a human, Why, isn't I he? I just spent the last two minutes trying... <laughs> Ginger snaps, thank you for the resub. That was funny. That was funny. I don't know what's going on here. I'm gonna have to figure out this later. Oh. No, she's having problems moving, period. Hold on. Okay. Now what happens if we say go here? There we go. She was stuck for some reason. That's really weird. Okay. Just, just order food. A single serving of a shrimp cocktail. She wants to watch a deer. Where would you watch a freaking deer? Not around here. There must be a deer bouncing around somewhere. Look at everyone who's running inside. Who is this? This is Ben Masai. You're black. <laughs> and this is Razor Zuli. Oh, what the frick? And Dragon Rana. Why, why is there a child coming into the bar? Dragon Rana, why? Oh my god, it's Doge. It's Onibiona's dog, Doge. Look at Doge. It's the appropriate Doge. Um, for anyone who hasn't seen Onibi Ona, which no one has seen Onibi yet, we've seen plenty of Doge so far. Onibi is basically a walking anime. Um, hence her having Doge. 
<laughs> when did Miss Butterbean from the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy get here? I have no idea. I don't know who Miss Butterbean is. I haven't seen enough of Billy and Mandy. Don't sigh at me! You don't even know Darkwing Duck properly! You're fucking old! Mm. Darkwing Duck! You're old! When there's trouble, you call DW! Mm. It's freaking amazing. Oh, look at everything here. Where are people going? Is there like a basement or something? No, there is not. There's... Oh, there is a second floor. Oh, look at how beautiful this is. Oh, the second floor overlooks the first floor. Interesting. Any games here? And you can blow bubbles. And Butterscotch is dying at home. Why is Butterscotch dying? Butterscotch! Wait, what does Butterscotch food dish look like? It's empty. The sadness of Butterscotch. Right there. Don't worry. Whenever you're starving, sleeping away the hunger pains is always the best option. Razor, what are you doing? See, Sasha, my heat. Ah, Yazuni, who? Razor, stop Red talking to her. To Zini Rev. Zelka. Zelka. Don't associate with her. You're not a proper celebrity. God so Okay, we're done. Stop listening to a story. Get out of here. Just get out. Just leave. Leave! Wait, what, what about this paparazzi guy? Draw his attention. Nah, we don't need to. We will become popular on our own accord. Come, Samantha. Wait, I feel like she moved really fast just now. Is everyone just running for the gate? Lifestyles of the fat and famous. No. I like how her one cocktail wiener is like satisfied her. Oh, look who it is. It's Coconut again. Doing God knows what. And this is Tear Dink Arrow again being emo on the street. Lindsay Gauthier, which was made by EA. Potato Queen! You were made! <laughs> oh my god. There you are! You have the most beautiful face ever. You're glorious. <laughs> the bird. Who is this? This is Darko. Darko, you have a beautiful beard. And this is Devin Haynes, who's a werewolf, apparently. Potato Queen. Don't ask me why Isaac did that. Don't ask me. But there you go. <laughs> Started raining in the Sim World and the Minecraft server you're on. Right at the same time. It's perfect! Everyone, what the hell is Coconut doing? It's not even normal. It's not even normal. If Potato Queen missed it, we'll have to wait until we see her sim again. Or, bye. That's how a werewolf runs with an umbrella, apparently. It's like this. What even? What even is this? Well, I'm glad she made it home. Nice and dry. Oh my god. Your sim probably isn't there because of antisocial. Your sim hasn't been showing up much of anywhere. Like, coconuts everywhere apparently, but your sim is just nowhere to be seen. So we got mushrooms. Should probably collect those. You know what we should do? Pay bills. And let's accept the gift from a friend and see if we can do that. Let's see what happens. Werewolf Sim? Yes, Werewolf Sim. 
Uh, let's see if it actually works. I don't think it'll work, because I keep having issues. I've been able to collect the mail once. Yeah, connection to the server has been lost. There's ways I, ha I have to delete out some files in the system, and when I do that, sometimes it clicks and works, but right now, there's no clicking and working! <sighs> and let's see. Let's, 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 we need to have an aspiration. What is this? Complete a renovation. It's pretty simple. Become best friends with Razor. No, we don't need to. Here, fill the bowl. Oh, jeez. Just raining. And then afterwards, she is going to use this. And sleep. Yes! I love like simple little tasks that just give you like points for their futures. Tyr is also the name of the main Norse god of war in their mythology. Is it? Ooh. Go to sleep, Samantha. It's been a long, hard day of d designing. And she's just not making much money. Maybe her, maybe if she really got married, her wife could just bring in more money as a police officer. What if she's not a very high level police officer? What if she doesn't make that much money? What if she's like a traffic cop? Or like, a, what, what do you call them? The parking ticket ladies? A meter maid. A meter maid. Oh! What if she's a meter maid? Oh my God. That's not perfect. That's like, Barely making it. Like, Samantha aspires to be more, but what if she, like, marries Cory, and Cory turns out that her only aspiration in life is just to have the uniform, and she doesn't strive to go you beyond a meter maid! talking like that! Oh my god. Your sim has given up on life. That's, that's, that's really hard to do. Like, congratulations? <laughs> She is a cop that came to deal with a burglar. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. Corey is at least a detective. Is that what it is? Oh my god. It's brilliant. It's brilliant. Okay. Maybe, since it's Saturday, we focus on the relationship. She doesn't have enough money for a perfect wedding right now. What if it's a silent, quiet wedding? And then they can have, like... They get divorced or something, and then have a proper marriage afterwards. Okay, what if they just throw a party? Bobby, stop it! Good night, assassin cat. No, Samantha's feeling Jeremy. Oh. She's sick. She got sick from being in the rain. She's gonna die. She's gonna die. This is the way of it. Perfection can't last long. We knew this was gonna happen. Where's the fucking hospital? I wanna see if there's options. Where the fuck is the hospital? Oh god. It's, it's gotta be red, right? It's just like red. This is the business. School. Where the hell is the hospital? Oh my god. In fact, everyone become Typhoid Mary. How dare you! She's perfect! She would not risk her- Oh my god, is there no hospital in this town? I I'm gonna have problems if the person who made St. Clair forgot the hospital. They couldn't have forgotten the hospital. You can put a hospital on later. Oh, I found it. Get a flu shot. Thank you, sci-fi roots. What do you mean, no more Salmon? How dare you? She's going to get a flu shot. Even if it's after the fact, maybe it'll help. So there. <laughs> Probably should have gotten one beforehand. Look. Look, 
You. Puppies are perfect as long as they're not heard throughout the night. Yipping and barking. Oh, you're so cute. Butterscotch, you're just the most perfect puppy. Aww. We did. Three more days. Three more. Puppy is gonna grow up soon. Oh my god. Except puppy is now yowling. Reinforcement. Scold for. Oh. She probably show love to the dog at some point, huh? Paint. That's her new one that she wants to do. That's fine. She can work on that. That's fine. Hola, bump pot. Did she just get up to tell the dog to stop? Oh, she did. I think. I think Butterscotch woke her up. I know. I believe since she's feeling germy for two days that her energy level's gonna drop really quickly. So let's see if we can rectify this. Let's see what happens if you get a flu shot. If only we could get our car out of the frickin' family inventory. It's stuck there. I hate that bug! And I hate the fact that that bug has been in existence since Ambitions was first released, and Maxis has refused to do anything about it. So for those of you who don't know, the bug is basically, if you have someone in the architectural design career, which is basically the interior designer stuff that Samantha's doing and Angela ended up doing. If your sim has a family car and they drive it to a lot, and let's say the lot has a parking spot on it, they're gonna park their car in the parking spot. The moment you begin the renovation of the house, it gets thrown into your family inventory, removed from the lot, but then there is, why the frick? Is there a horse in the middle of the street? I thought I turned Wild Horses off. Let me see if it turned itself back on. Um, but there's a chance that they get stuck in the family inventory. Yeah, population control settings. No horses. Because I didn't want wild horses running... It's already there. Maybe. Who's this? Carolina Mosley, proprietor. What's up, bitch? Because you have bitch face and bitch look about you. Anyways, on to the hospital. Whatever happened to Evil Dead standing up one the The wood that Salmon is mounted on needs to be Salmon. Oh my god. That's revolutionary and perfect. What, what does she want to do about horses? Watch a wild horse, no. You don't need to watch a wild horse. What? What What are you talking about, Gabriel Kane? Whatever happened to Evil Dead Stand-In number... How dare you, eh, Gabriel Kane? Angela is not Evil Dead Stand-In! She is the boss to us! We're all about Samantha Pickering now. Watching how beautiful and perfect she strives to be. We're hoping that one day she can become big enough and famous enough that she can hold her own dinner parties where she can invite many others. Oh, look, it worked. She's been immunized and will be able to avoid the nasty germs this year. It's gone. Yay. So it does work. So if they feel germy, take them to the hospital, get the, uh, get the flu shot, and they go back to normal. Yay. Yay! It's 9.05 a.m. Yay! Here, let's do this. Um, invite out. No, don't go home. We're gonna invite her out. We're gonna go to... It's 9 a.m. We should go to the bar. No. We're gonna go to a very nice diner or something. Bruja House. We're gonna go to Bruja House. We don't know what this is, but we're gonna go here. Sure, that sounds like fun. Let's meet there. Oh my god, Corey's coming! She is perfection. Why would she become Typhoid Mary? 
She is not a bad Electra villain from a horrible movie. Oh, there she is. Oh, that's right. Her sense of style is something to be desired. Her, her top says slutty. Her skirt says cute but slutty. And her vest says, I desire to work at Home Depot. We'll work on that. Romantic. Give flowers. Give romantic red. Butterscotch has a beginning of so attention and social interaction lately. Butterscotch, what is wrong with you? Just send him to the neighbor's house. He can't. He's a puppy. He can't walk down the fucking stairs. That's the problem. Stop, me not. Mm -hmm. He needs a radio. You're right. Hold on. <laughs> just, just. <laughs> Hold on. We'll fix this. Can you also turn on the TV one? I don't know. Can you turn it on from a distance? Turn on. I guess. Let's find out. <laughs> Black and Zunorba! Oh. She bought romantic Calvin. red flowers for you. Samantha learned that Cory is a kleptomaniac. Well, I guess everyone has flaws. Oh, we want to woohoo with Cory, do we? I see that as being impossible. Cook Cory's favorite meal. Not yet. <laughs> oh. She thinks she's being flirty, huh? Um. Heat of the moment kiss. <gasps> oh, yes. <laughs> Look at that. Less beyond love. Oh my god, honey, the Lebanese are so adorable. The Lebanese are great. I love the Lebanese. Social is not going up for butterscotch. Barcat? That's what I'm trying. Come on, butterscotch. No. Damn it. You need a radio then. I don't know where to put the radio. We're kind of running out of room in the house. Damn it! It's got like a record player or something. Put it outside. No. Deck. No! It's just asking to be stolen! Hold on. What is this? Per per stereo? Oh, it's adorable. Easy listening stereo? No. What are these all super over the top ones now? It's like an iPod thing. Athletic group activity. It's 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 disgustingly cute. We're gonna put it on a table at some point, but for now, it's right here. And we're gonna say, turn on. And we're gonna say, change to classical. And how along with. <laughs> Meanwhile, Samantha's trying to make her way there. Is this even working? Yeah, 
No, he stopped doing it. He's desolate. We're coming! We're coming to hug you! You don't need much attention! Where's Cory? Cory. You don't need to go to the movies with her. Stop it. That's not how you get laid. We left her. Cory, meet us there! Don't worry. I came home for the needy puppy. Thank God you're absolutely perfectly adorable. Are, are you gonna come over so you can be hugged? Where's your fucking date? Oh my God, what if we left Cory? Oh my God, here she is. She came through the back door. Where the fuck did she come from? No. Hug. Pet. Affection. Heat treat. Oh. You're so adorable, Butterscotch. Butterscotch is super adorable, guys! Look at that. Oh, look at Look, there's nothing perfect than a perfect hostess. With her perfect little purse. A puppy. An adorable, perfect puppy. So cute! No one should remember Surf Ninjas. What the hell is Surf Ninjas? I don't know if I should know what this is. What thing on the top right? The fuzz coins? Yeah, or push it further up. I can't. Why am I pushing it? It's just like in the middle of the screen and it stops me from getting good photos. Because it's always in the frickin' middle of the screen. Okay. There. Is that better? Yeah, that's much better. Thank you. Okay. Oh, She's getting don't hungry. Don't worry. She is gonna serve brunch with autumn salad. You are not preparing pancakes. You stop that right now. You realize we just bought a bunch of crap? She took a book off the bookshelf. These doors are gonna be locked to make sure that you can't leave with that book. What did we say about this last time, Corey? Okay. The book is fine as long as you put it back before you leave. In the meantime, we're gonna make a nice, adorable autumn salad. We're gonna watch Samantha make an autumn salad from over here. What are you doing with the book? What are you doing? That's not putting it back! down. The book is down. We can unlock it. Okay, go. That's not how you spell Cory Kyle Benjamin Ross. Thank you. It's a C-O-R-R-I-E. Thanks. Oh. We're just gonna have to watch her Salud. from a bit of a distance. Make sure she's not doing anything weird. Butterscotch loves her. It's so adorable. Here. Pay more attention to her. Friendly. Sniff. Uh, play tug of war. Oh, me vibe. Look how adorable Butterscotch is. <laughs> Butterscotch is keeping Cory all happy. <laughs> While Samantha works on the most perfect salad ever. Oobly. Ugh. <clears throat> Did you just say no to him wanting to play? <sighs> We're going to have to change her disposition a little bit. Sniff. Friendly, bark it. Friendly, sick. Oh. Oh. 
Okay. She's a meter maid? Excuse you? Excuse you? What? What? Uh, no. So what else can you expect? Oh. The salad is going to oh. be sucked. Lene. No, it's not. It is the quality of da 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 high quality. Yes. Grab a plate. You, you, you can stop begging for food, butterscotch. Butterscotch is being a pig. Hmm. Did you really need to fill the food bowl? Whatever, as long as we didn't pay for it. Is it a Caesar salad? No, it's an autumn salad. There's apples in it. It is properly mm. dainty for EAT FOOD! <sighs> Whatever. She doesn't have to eat, I guess. Corey, Samantha went to great lengths to make food that you could eat. And, and I see what you're doing. Just making sure. That goes back. <laughs> All we were doing. And now that's broken. <sighs> this is a problem because if I unlock the door for the repair person, she can leave with the book. Okay. Yeah, she's a klepto. We're we're not doing this here. We're gonna go. We're gonna relax in bed. Oh, Fleeb! On the plus side, it's kleptos, from what I remember, from what Isaac told me, can't steal anything in the Sims game until after six or something. Yeah, but books don't count. What? Books don't count. They just have them. No. Completer innovation paint. No. Just call over. Join me. You gotta join. Tana. Come here. These spite heeled shoes aren't made for this bed, but we're keeping them on. The tide, not the tide. Um, excuse you? Tide pods are known to be the best appetizers? Ha ha! Ha ha! The divine goddess watches over us all. What? Bodhi just walked up to Tiger. Epsumo mm. movie? Sniff Tiger. Tiger sniffed Bodhi. Bodhi walked away. Mm. Dude. Good. Um, Look at the cuddling of the bed! Hmm. It's actually really good about that. Kiss. Mm -hmm. Oh. Let's ask about your career. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Let's make out. Mm -hmm. And that's woo ho. Mm -hmm. Let's do it! What Angel watching? Yes. Yes. Mm. <coughs> mm. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. But they have to sit back and they're going to talk about her career right now. Nebi Yekabu, Nupi Tabembem, Beso Gepsa, Vijuje Upadawa. I know Wengel that Bofna. she's a handy technophobe who's a kleptomaniac. Yergi. She doesn't have any partner. We obviously know that. What else do we know about her? Apparently nothing. Hip out a hip. Berkey nerve. Samantha learned that Corey is a policewoman. What does that mean? What does it mean? Zuwab to door. Subtle? Oh yeah. Let's. Um... Let's that bounce our her. mounds against each other. Oh no! 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 Okay, make out first. Let me kiss. Cuddle on the bed. Okay, now make out. 
Now kiss. This may take some time. Yeah, she's a kleptomaniac policewoman. We knew she was a policewoman. Oh, yes. This is the proper way to do things. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. More. Let's... Let's... Woohoo. Can you can you both stop? Can you both stop? It's starting to be like sim porn. Oh. Oh, Samantha. Samantha knows how to woo her over. Come on, yes. Come on, the divine designer is blessing us. She's watching. She's watching. Come on. Oh, come on. We just had an amazing makeout session. Yeah. Ah, oh, yes! And something else broke. What just broke? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You don't want to buy a dryer. Just get over it. Oh, I think she went to sleep like that. No, she didn't. Okay. Samantha Pickery just woohooed with Cory Gooden for the first uh, Gooden. The awkwardness of that first romantic encounter won't be forgotten soon, nor will the excitement of fresh romance. Oh my god, you're gonna have water damage soon. Yes. So, now that we have had our mounds bumping against each other, we are going to call services. No. What, what was it under? More. It's services. Call services. Call for services. Things breaking in the house is a perfect backdrop for sex. Look at this. Twilight onions. A uh, woman's oh, underwear. <laughs> Look at that. Yes. You did touch the perfection. The perfect, <laughs> the perfect hole for your hand and other things. I don't know as much. Let's see, repair. Repair woman. You missed a lot, Maya. Welcome back, and thank you for the restop. Thanks for the call. Be over as soon as I can get our, your appliances all fixed up. She's just grabbed the book again. We're gonna have to unlock one of the doors. Clean. She has to clean. What time is it? It's 7:03 p.m. And this is what their this is what their date has been has been reduced to. I think she needs a shower. Wait, what is what is this from? High school diploma. Why is that on the wall? Why would you showcase your high school diploma? Let me see. It's not letting me put it on the wall. That's the thing. Seems like something that should be in the next renovation. What? Just give them a high school diploma? Should have given it to the kid that I redesigned their room for. Looks like a lesbian date to you. One of them reads, the other one mops. They both make sandwiches. So many sandwiches. What? <laughs> Make breakfast. It's 9, 7, 30 p.m. We're not making breakfast. In fact, we're going to stop mopping right now. What? Zorp-dortle. It's 9, 7, 30 p.m. I thought it was 9 p.m. 7, 30 p.m. No tension chat. No, it's, I'm talking about sim time. It's now 7, 53 p.m. Oh, my God. It was the original one. The original one who we were going to try and date is back. Oh. She's probably handy too. Look at her! Micro cheating by staring at her ass! Oh! Don't freak out over the freaking sink, it's your goddamn job! Oh my god. 
I like how Samantha's just in her underwear for her. What is... Aw, uh, Butterscotch is... Yimpering, whimpering in bed. Whimpering. Whimpering. We're gonna go for another hour, guys. We did start early, but we're gonna go for the full amount of time that we normally do. Really? Did you take your phone into the shower with you? I mean, I know that the Sims do this, but this is rather hysterical. Oh my god. She does need a better shower or something. She missed that phone call. Where are you going with the book? Where are you going with the book? Oh my god, she put it away. Okay. Okay. Unlock. That was not locked. Okay, good. Okay, okay, okay. We got it, we got it, we got it. Can this woman leave? You can say you dismissed. She's just not going anywhere. What about you two? Oh, oh, have you gotten to the point where you can watch each other poop? We had sex once, and now we can stand in the same room while pooping. No, honey. There is no to be fair in this. After we had sex once, I can I've seen you poop. Thanks. Uh, actually, you don't need Showtime for Sims 3 to become famous. The celebrity system became part of... Sims 3 period in one of the patches. <coughs> so, I didn't have Showtime before my celebrity, when my Sims celebrity status just appeared one day. She's going after Book again! Um, ask to leave the date. Actually, wait. Romantic. Hold hands, embrace, confess. Do you want to stay over more? <sighs> Cannot propose yet. So, so. Keep her. Well, it's still the weekend. We still have time. Samantha learned that Lillian is a hopeless romantic. Get out of here before you ruin the relationship! You put that book back! <laughs> Freaking klepto. I mean, we love you. She thinks she's being very alluring. After a wonderful date like that, there's no hand wringing over calculating moves to worm your way into another one. It is inevitable you'll be seeing each other again soon. Oh my god. Let's put this book back before she has a chance to take it. <coughs> and we're going to sleep. Shut up! Wait, how bad is she sleepy? How sleepy is she? No, she can stand this. Here, clean the house. What the hell? The frick was that? <coughs> Did lightning just strike next to the house? Where, where's Butterscotch? Right in here. <sighs> okay. Sleepy times. It did sound like it broke something. Jeez. God was trying to strike down the gays in the Sims game. Kiss Cory. A lot of stuff you want to do with Cory. Let's see. Job experience. I think she needs to practice her painting on a medium painting. Tiger. Tiger's not super happy with Bodhi. Bodhi's like, okay. Bodhi! Buddy! 
Bodie, what are you doing? Bodie, honey, Bodie's about to pounce on me. Bodie, you've made such progress today. <laughs> Stop it. You spaced out and the lightning almost made you shit yourself in terror. Yeah, seriously. Look at, look at this. There's a seed right here. It's an unknown, uncommon seed. What are you doing at him? Buddy! He's so cute. He's so adorable. Tiger's coming! <coughs> Tiger's all like, Bodhi went downstairs, Isaac went downstairs, it must be food time. I must go downstairs. That's pretty much what happens. I can hear other sims, but from what? Over here at 4.33 a.m., other sims need to make noises. <coughs> that seems not needed. Maybe I should save before God tries to kill the gays again. I just saved not long ago! Jeez, 7.58! We have another hour! I'm gonna have another cough drop because I'm making phlegmy noises into the microphone and I'm sure that's going over well. <laughs> God won't try to kill the gays. The Sim God has no power. Oh, wait, he does. I am the Sim God! <clears throat> How do I force lightning to strike? That would be amazing. Was that Angela's wrath? No! Angela blesses love! She's the divine designer! She believes in love! Do you believe in life after love? <laughs> oh my god, the same screen is so long! Is this one epic save file? Da 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 Da, 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 da. There might be a mod for that. I'm scared of the mods. The mods can fuck things over too much. That's why I don't like using them. Was Angela the sim before Samantha? Yes. Angela was the sim before Samantha. We followed Angela every Sunday for about two years. I did the sim stream for about two years with Angela desi redesigning everyone's life. In a totally different town, which... My original intention was to, once Angela ended up passing away, that another sim would come along, and Samantha ended up being that sim, and would pick up where Angela left off. Unfortunately, due to the bug that ended up causing Angela to leave us in France, where she was lost tragically, um, I lost pretty much the town that I had created or used. I used one of the base towns. I think it was the uh, Supernatural Expansion Town. But then as I got more and more expansions, I kept adding things into the town. Then I made houses for all the subs and such that they would live in. And I really liked how the town was shaping out and how it felt. But the bug pretty much up and killed it. There was no recovering the town. It was gone. So that's why we have St. Clair. Because I decided to try and do something that was different and not easy to see for people. But... Ooh, what's this? Um, I'm also a little worried that St. Clair has so much stuff in it that the load times are too big. Your sim was probably eaten by coconut. It's very possible. <clears throat> the loss of Angela has been a severe blow to all of us. Samantha hopes to one day make her own trip to France so that she can... Remember what Angela was contributing to the world. 
Unfortunately, we'd have to do over all the tombs that we've done before. Because new sim and new world. Oh, well. Is she, is she going to get up anytime soon? She has a few things that she's going to be doing first. And then she's going to... Do you know, eat leftovers and autumn salad. A meal befitting a young lady. Dainty and pure. Salad. <sighs> Butterscotch's birthday is tomorrow. We have to get ready for the special day. Butterscotch, get out of the room. She has to move. You're not going to be a puppy anymore. You're the most perfect puppy. Oh my Just god. Like a thiefy new Butterscotch robot. is gonna grow up. We're gonna watch Butterscotch's birthday, guys! What the fuck about Ella? Dilly, huh? Cause you miss Ella. Who the hell is Ella? Oh. Ella? Who are you talking about? What? Ella. Angela is remembered in your town thanks to an excellent memorial museum. There is a memorial museum. Slave Ella? Who? I don't know what you're talking about. We worry and mourn over Angela's loss. This Ella person or whatever. Yeah, she obviously wasn't as important. Okay. We know this. You always heard Slave Ella. Sleep a lot. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I am not a horrible person! I remember the people that matter! Angela. Mm. Angela. Mm. <laughs> Angela. <laughs> Angela. Oh, wait. For those who haven't seen it, you should probably go there at some point, but... Where'd it go? Hold on. Wh why? Why are there fucking wild horses here? <laughs> I'm so angry right now. Angela. Oh, Angela. Your beautiful bust is so magnificent and gold. Angela. We will always remember you at the Angela Memorial Museum. I don't know what you're talking about. We know of the adopted child. We don't talk about her much because she's just a blip in Angela's history, okay? Angela was far more than a mother. Because she was a mother to us all. Look how beautiful this place is. It's gorgeous. Anyways... Did Slave Ella escape? Um, escape from what? Do we have to go down this path again? Clean the dishes, yes. Mop a puddle. Oh god, there's a puddle. Uh, here. She's gonna just mop the puddle. She's gonna get that. Because our little puppy is having issues. Wait, where's the dish? How come I can't interact with the dish? Clean up. There we go. It's because the table's too white. Freaking weird. Slavella was far better than Angela and she was an underdeveloped side character? HOW DARE YOU! Angela is the divine designer that we all remember, church, and love. And Samantha plans on bringing that perfection to a new level. To a new level. But practice the painting, a medium one. It's gonna be... Butterscotch's birthday! Butterscotch is no longer gonna be a puppy. It's gonna be sad. 
Am I being racist to the table, Dilly? Yes, it's so it's so white, it just glows, and I can't see other plates oh. on it. I keep looking to the door because of the Animal Crossing music. It's beautiful, Samantha. If you were painting as if a four-year-old was painting, this is perfection. Ding dong, the witch is dead. How dare you! We are focusing on Samantha's perfection right now, okay? Okay. Is there a fan fiction for Angela and or Samantha? No. As far as I know, there isn't. If there is, we would definitely have to do a reading of it. Um, I don't know how we would do it, but it wouldn't be on a Sunday. This is, this is beautiful. This is a beautiful painting. This is gonna go in someone's house. This. That Messiah Dave Takeda picture! Oh, she's got a weekly stipend of 400 simoleons. Keep up the good work. Let's see. Her job experience is going up. Good, 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 good. This is really good. No, answer the phone. Answer the phone. It's, it's Zaku. Don't answer the phone. Don't answer the phone. Paint some more. <laughs> Mushroom. Taylor one zero three one is follow. Thank you for the follow. Oh, Maya redeemed a kitty picture as well. <laughs> oh my god. Did Angela look? Did Angela paint this exact same painting? If you're gonna nickel and dime on the pictures, there's only so many images in The Sims Three. So calm your tits! The door didn't bell didn't ring! <laughs> so Freaking Animal Crossing music. <laughs> so. Ooh! Samantha has been conferred the new title of Feng Shui Fiend by the town council in recognition of her valuable contributions to the workforce. You're starting to show some confidence, and your clients have noticed. When the budget gets tight, look for some old furniture that's begging to be sold. Clients won't miss that old painting. And surely they don't like that aged rug anyway. You're the architectural designer. Your opinion is law! Samantha now makes 560 simoleons per week and works from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. Yes. This is going to take fucking forever to get that one, so no. Host a sim at a coffee house. No. Because that's a pain in the ass to do with the way the freaking game is running. Unfortunately. Use. The painting's almost done. Are you serious? It's done. All right. All right. Name. Isaac's the one that pays more attention to this, so. There you go. RJ has to crest its imitation of Pennywise. You're welcome. You notice that I'm hyper and I seem pretty awesome? That's good to know. I would be more hyper if I was more awake than I am right now, because right now I'm fighting off the need for wanting coffee and going to bed. Um, <laughs> but I mean, it is a sim stream. What else did you want? Hyperactivity comes with the Samantha video streams. Samantha is perfect. She's painting Isaac and it's not okay. That is not Isaac. That is a Pennywise flower. It's RJ has Crested's imitation of Pennywise. Get out of here, little thing! Clean bargain, John. God fucking damn it. You know what? We need to start upgrading. Clean until pristine. We need to start upgrading all of her crap in the house because the shower, the toilet, and everything, the lower quality ones are the ones that break the most often. So when you get the better ones, they don't break. Or we could just marry the handy woman and make her have them unbreakable. Because she can upgrade things. You've been crying this entire stream? Is that because we lost Angela? I, I understand your pain. It's okay. What is she currently at for her opportunities and such? Or her lifetime goals? 7,000. Not right now, honey. Thank you. Thank you. I just had a cough drop, that's why. It's a little taste funny. I want to have a little bit. Thank you. I love you. 
What what are you what are you doing? Stop pressing your cheek against ow. Ow. <laughs> Who is Angela? Oh my god! Angela is the previous sib, the divine designer, the most glorious one. This is Angela. Okay, hold on. That's it. It's Sunday. It's 4 p.m. We have enough time for this. We're going to the museum. Visit the designs by Angela Memoriam. So, on Sundays, before we had Living by Samantha... Here's the title, in case you were wondering. Um, Sunday with Living by Samantha. Our most famous and gracious hostess for Sundays in the past who tells us. This is Tayo Goobs. Oh my god, it's Tayo. It's it's Gab's hubby. It's Tayo. <laughs> oh, wait, who's this? Axel. Axel Sterlusky. This is this is the other Axel, not our Axel Rar mod. This is the other Axel. The hell is wrong with this child? It's a helmet on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Anyways, <coughs> before we have no, it's perfectly fine, Taylor. Uh, <laughs> before we had living by Samantha, <laughs> we had <laughs> adopt me. <laughs> Before we had Living by Samantha, we had uh, the Sunday Streams, which was designed by Angela, where interior design was executed by our great divine designer, Angela Keeperton. Angela Keeperton was a glorious woman who only searched for love her entire life. And in the process of searching for love, she went through four husbands before the stream mysteriously and suddenly ended due to her loss in France, where Interpol is looking for her to this day. You don't even know how to sign the cross. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> um, so we will take you to the museum so that you can see who Angela was. Because when Angela was lost to us... Which it, 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 it must know it was because of a freaking bug due to AA. Because if you take a sim to the World Adventures area, so we took her to France, there's a small chance your sim just stops existing. So I tried recovering from the bug, it's pretty much unrecoverable, which is why I'm backing up save games now. Um, but at any rate, so that you may know, this massive memorial in this town was built in honor of Angela, the divine designer, the one and the only, what is wrong with this sim that is outside? The master of pink and gold, who the hell is this? I'm having problems with, uh oh. Hold on. No. It's it's just the game being the game, honey. Calm down. Who is this? Why is he staring at a wall? This is Kaz. Kaz no, no blighter. This is Kaz? What did you do to Kaz? I'm, I'm hoping that Huggy and Lasana are still here because one of them needs to somehow take this screenshot and show it to him. Hold on, because I'm, I'm gonna screenshot this for him. <laughs> just, there's Kaz, okay. <laughs> just, just, just. Anyways, in honor of losing our wonderful divine designer, Angela, the museum was created and fashioned in the colors that she used the most often, pink and gold. To remind us always of who she is. And the fact that every one of her designs was accompanied by a knife block. Why a knife block, you ask? Many have asked that, and the answer is simple. For when the children come over, they needed something to play with. Our first room. To give you an idea of the kind of person she was. It's just, hold on, just, just, are you serious? Are you, are you freaking serious? Here was the poster from Interpol when we were looking for her. I, I, I did custom make all these using like, I didn't have Photoshop, I have GIMP. Um, I should get Photoshop. This is a cutout of what her living room, part of her living room used to look like. It was a very, very 
well-known section of her living room. This is her in her elder years. Before we lost her, Angela Keeperton was just as divine as she was in the beginning. And this is the famous portrait that you've seen before. And these are her awards that she won for all of her design work and the statues that used to adorn her house, along with, yet again, another knife block. Let's go to the next room! It's just, who's this? That's Jermaine McCurdy. Got here. I believe that's just, yeah, that's just that. Yeah. Woo! Freaking Sims freaking out over there. Let's just go in here. Uh -huh. And then the memorial of her cats. For the story goes, for those of you who weren't here for her designs by Angela, that with the passing of each of her husbands, a cat was adopted <coughs> and named after the previous husband. We start with her first husband, Herman, Herman Keeperton, and the glorious cat that came from Herman's passing, Herman Keeperton the kitty. Followed by Flint, her second husband, and the cat Flint. Followed by, oh wait, it's not over there. Followed by Gladstone, the once the perfect, the one that everyone thought was gonna last, Gladstone and the kitty that he became. And then finally, that one. This one barely deserves a name. We don't talk about Peanut much or his attempt to look like Gladstone. Probably because Peanut was a no good filthy scumbag in the end. Oh yeah, and I guess here's here's that Ella girl that people were talking about earlier. This is Slave Ella. I guess I guess she's important or something. Okay, anyways, let's go on. Why is your father yelling gay? How dare you! All the husbands died in horrible. They were horrible accidents. They were horrible, horrible accidents. They were all incredibly wealthy men who died the moment after they found true love with Angela Keeperton, our divine designer. And the knife block, once again. Each room in the museum is a reminder of Angela. This room is a mock-up of one of her designs. Oh, no, no, stop it. Yeah, stop it. Yeah, just stop. Oh God, this is this is this is like this is what her living rooms would look like. The glorious. Yes. Oh yeah, and let us not forget the picture, the lament of Gladstone. And what is going on with the lighting here? The lighting is having some serious issues, and we're gonna go here. Uh, please take no offense. Is Dilsick gay? Oh my nope. god. No, totally not. No. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm oh, Dilly, yeah. and Isaac is the other one that's yelling. We're a couple. There's oh, the lament of Gladstone hit again. And these are the famous sons. And let us not forget the horrors of the twins ew. as they passed from our world. Gay people are bad. Would you shut up? <laughs> no. Hi! Hi. <laughs> freaking hell. And that is the end of the tour of the museum and it's beautiful and it's great. Uh, wait, what is this? Wash hands two times. You don't need to be that neurotic. Oh, look! Ben Masai's coming to the museum. Goodbye, Ben Masai. <laughs> and then we're gonna go back to her house and who knows what we're doing. It's 7 p.m. Angela Smith has spent her... Angela spent her day being dead, apparently. Or missing. We're not sure which. But Samantha has spent her day painting... Eating leftovers and going to the museum of the one person that reminds her of who she is and where she is. She's having a blast. And she feels fulfilled, apparently. Why does she feel fulfilled? Having a wish come true from completing a promised wish. And I guess because she was at the museum, she was considered to have fun. We love you, Samantha. I know. 
I know. I know. Peanut did not appreciate our divine goddess. He did not. Peanut came home. Okay, so apparently there's something like a 1% chance. Congratulations, Taylor, and welcome to the family. Um, but Peanut, the, apparently there's a 1% chance in The Sims 3 that your Sim will accuse their husband, wife, spouse, whatever, of cheating even if they never have. Peanut came home and had the audacity to accuse Angela of infidelity. No one was sad to see him go that night. When death came knocking, everyone just said, please take him. It's fine. It's been a long day, Samantha. A very long day. And you have only so much left that you can do in this day. You're gonna take this painting because it is gonna go into a design. You are about to become a glorious, glorious designer, I guess. Whatever. Hold on, eat leftovers, autumn salad. Go, it's, it's perfect. You were a beautiful, dainty woman, and you were going to eat the salad. You're going to chew on it with your heart's content. That is just gross, and I have no idea what kind of joke you're trying to make there, but it sounds roughly sexual. This is glorious. This, what the hell was that? I feel like that was her trying to say, mm, and like the speed differences being weird. <coughs> Butterscotch, you're the most perfect little puppy, and it's almost your birthday. Well, this is adorable, and it's beautiful. It's great. Oh, Samantha's life is going to be perfect, and she's going to continue working at this perfection every single day that she has a moment. And apparently... Butterscotch doesn't know how to stop running around in circles. And is about to piddle on the porch. Well, and bark at things. Butterscotch, you're so adorable. It's about to be your birthday! Aww. Technically, it's Dilly. We put our names together. We ship ourselves for our channel. But it works. Especially if you're doing an app. ba da 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 what, what are you saying, honey? The only children we will ever have are the cats. How dare you? What the fuck is that face? <laughs> we cannot handle a child. We forget to scoop their poop. He's alive! We forget to scoop their poop! This poor child with a diaper! Oh my god! <laughs> You frequently go, I don't feel like cooking tonight. Well, guess what? Children need to eat every night. Priority number one is teaching the kid to wipe their own ass. Like within two weeks, right? Uh. <laughs> Why does hashtag break up blame me? Oh my god, snow's coming. That's the one that Axel did. Winter's coming! It is, actually. What day is it? It's one day until winter. As the leaves slowly die, so does Butterscotch's perfect youth. This little puppy, this adorable puppy, is about to lose innocence. Butterscotch is so happy. We got Butterscotch. Oh my god! <sighs> this is what happens with, with Butterscotch. There's oh things. God. There's things that happen. <sighs> of course, he had to destroy the most expensive thing in the house, in general. Why doesn't he attack his toy? I don't know. He had the non-destructive trait, like, built into him, so I don't know. Yeah, Butterscotch did that. How the Ponzi play myself? Look. 
Butterscotch is a special puppy, but a perfectly happy puppy. It's hard to maintain a good relationship when you don't call or hang out with friends. Chaos Longshot Gamers and Samantha Pickering are no longer friends. Well, that's your own problem, Chaos! Oh, hi! Samantha Pickering just became friends with a celebrity, Razor Zuli. Making a new friend is always memorable. Oh my god, Razor. Oh my god. And she took a trip to the art gallery. Okay, whatever. She wants to bathe. She wants to become friends with Chaos. Look at how happy Butterscotch is. Aww, oh, yep, yep, yep. Oh, Butterscotch. You're adorable. And hungry, apparently. Pretty sure there's food in your bowl. There is. We don't have to worry about you. Feed yourself. Oh, he's, he, Butterscotch is about to piddle on the patio. We've got to do something about having a house with a foundation and a puppy. Because it'd be a lot easier if Butterscotch could walk herself outside and piddle. What the hell? Let me go, bitch. Let me go, bitch. <laughs> Creepy ass celebrity. Actually, he's a he's a paparazzi. Don't let him in. Don't let him in, Butterscotch. He'd be a good little puppy. Let him stay out there. Kind of creepy. Let's see. Yeah, there's there's a lot of gifted subs here. Thanks to Lasana, who has a personal mission of trying to get every single viewer into the town. Is that is that a legit doorbell? That's a legit doorbell. At 2:59 a.m. Uh oh. Game. Game. Give it a sec, it has to think. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Who's making that noise? <clears throat> Jeez. Uh. <clears throat> Yeah, there's a creeper paparazzi. <laughs> Butterscotch is running around in circles. Dogs need to chew on things, and Butterscotch is feeling pent up. Then chew on this! <laughs> oh my god. Mushroom. Oh my god. Yeah, Lissana is cool and amazing. Harper D4 has followed. Thank you for the follow. So did a Sarah Baron. I kind of missed that. And Taylor, thank you for the follow. In case I missed you, because I'm absolutely horrible at paying attention to the follows when I do the sim stream sometimes. But I try to get everyone. I try. I have a little ticker here so I can like double check on people. And the game is like chugging right now for some reason. It's probably because I was trying to make it do go fast and. Uh, why is her? Oh no, her energy's fine. No, stop trying to do that. Buy a mistletoe. Ooh. Mistletoe's a perfect thing for the season. We should do that. Um, no. <clears throat> we'll do that. Let's see, where do we buy mistletoe? Sculptures. I think it's under miscellaneous decor. I just don't remember where... Uh, does anyone remember where it is? Dilly Dad asked Isaac if you can stay. If you can stay where? Yeah, Daddy Dilly. Come are you on, Daddy Dilly. Are you trying to bring that back? Because that's old to the point that I just don't give a crap about it anymore. <laughs> He's like, oh. <laughs> <clears throat> Where's mistletoe? I don't remember where mistletoe goes. Why can't she buy- oh, because these are all street things. Where does mistletoe go? 
Well, here's this one. Here's the winter wreath. Is this mistletoe? This is mistletoe. Where do you put this? I can't buy mistletoe because I have nowhere to put it. Wait. You can put it right here. It has to be one giant blank area. One giant blank 4x4 four four area. What kind of bullshit is that? Mistletoe just above the bed. Oh, yeah. Can I put the wreath on the door? What do you mean, no? Oh my god. It's Christmas time. It's, 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 the, it's the Christmas season for them. Holiday house lights. So you guys can see these now. So you just put up a strip of multicolored. Bing. Uh oh. Holiday house lights. Hanging. Multicolored. There we go. It's multicolored house lights for the Christmas season. And then she wants to kiss someone underneath it. Fill the pet food bowl. Well, of course. Oh, butterscotch. <laughs> Isn't it butterscotch's birthday? <clears throat> Finally, holiday house lights. Yeah, seriously. No Thalman Christmas lights? Um, excuse you. I don't think I have that much fine-tuning of the colors scheme, unfortunately. Because, obviously, when I say holiday house lights, hanging, I get red. Or a custom color. I don't know what the custom color is. I have to find out. We have to find out what the custom color is. Hold on. So if I take this, and if I sit there and say, Thalman, for instance. No, Thalman. This is 241 1 can, can you, honey? Yes. 244 528 Two, what? Oh my god. I forgot I set these to numbers here. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Two, four, one, one, two, three. Thank you, Amaya. One oh six. That are thumbin. Beautiful, beautiful thumbin Christmas lights. <laughs> you shut up. You stop it. Be mean. <clears throat> what? You? It's gross. Oh, Samantha. She's gonna have to use the bathroom. And then she's gonna have leftovers of an autumn salad because it's perfectly dainty. Now, it doesn't matter what time of day it is, but a salad is perfectly dainty <laughs> for a young lady like Samantha. Butterscotch is sleeping away. <laughs> oh, God. What? Oh, okay. She loaded in. The hell game. It was all like, oh, I don't need to load her. And she just looked crazy creepy. <coughs> Why not a salmon salad? Because I don't have that option. And I don't know if it's available for them to make. If it is, I would do it. Hmm. May eat it. I don't even know if she needs to clean the house at this point. Does she need to clean the house? <laughs> oh yeah, there's oh, a puddle for her to, to clean up. It's perfect. Practice your painting. Make it a small painting. 
We need more paintings for you to hang up. Oh. Hmm. What is pe what what is going on outside with people? Why is this guy still on her porch? Ugh. Why does he have memories he's making on her porch? Is he like jacking it on her front door? Like, oh yeah, I remember the day that I fapped in front of her door. Oh yeah. You're searching for the extension called Fuzz Coins, but you can't find it? I have no idea how the Fuzz Coins work. Isaac does, and he's sitting right here conveniently. And also knows how to do this command, exclamation, Fuzz Coins. Mushroom. And uh, there you go. Cinder Peach, thank you for the follow! Also, Phoenix Wolf, thank you for the five bits that I missed. Oh, it's for Butterscotch. Oh my god, it's super sweet! Oh my god, I love this. <laughs> It's just a glorious day. He's like, come on, Samantha. This is a very special day. He's taking a selfie door edition. What? The fappening door edition. <laughs> what is he doing? He's staring at his phone. Guy looks sad like he needs friends. Well, the question is does Samantha engage him because she believes in being the perfect ho hostess? Oh. Friendly introduction. Mm. She does believe in this. She's the perfect hostess. Angela had the power to command whether people should come and go out of her life, but Samantha believes that everyone needs to be accepted. Not necessarily for who they are, because that can change, but for who they can be, if not perfect already. It's perfectly fine. She should call her girlfriend and kick her into the curb. She should, actually. She should just, like, already just marry her girlfriend, honestly. Look at the psychedelic colors. I mean, this is the perfect vision of someone on drugs if Samantha had ever taken drugs. But that would mean she's not perfect and we know she is. He's looking for Angela. He only has to go to the museum and then find her. What should we name this? We should name it after, let's see. Let's see. Hold on. Name. Let's see, Taylor 1031's rabbit hole. Let's put hole in parentheses because it means a lot more. Let's take painting. Oh, God. <laughs> oh geez, there's Freddy mail. Shay, Shay, Pay the bills. So, so. She just got excited oh, about this guy. Do not invite him inside. Unless you saying hello to him it constitutes inviting him inside. What is this guy doing? He has some severe issues. The angel pictures on the It is on the screen, damn it! You're right, I'm sorry. Damn it. Uh -huh. <sighs> I'll have to unbind those. I originally bound them to my numpad so I can go through it during the introduction every time, but it's kind of a little mismatched in being bound at the moment. Get mail. Why is there mail? Um, so it doesn't work perfectly fine and I keep on accidentally hitting it. She has a gift from someone? What is this? Hey, there's a letter for Samantha from Lorraine McFarland. It says, Dear Samantha, I can tell that you're a very special person, and if we didn't take the chance to get to know each other better, I would forget it forever. Lorraine McFarland, you have beautiful hair. But we regret to inform you that Samantha Pickering has been taken. Did you give her a gift at least? Like, was it just a letter, or did you actually give a gift? Oh, it was just a letter. Well, she is taken! This guy looks like the grown-ass men that cosplay the kid from Black Butler. Oh. What? What? 
honey, no. Bluish eggs with a sweat. Him of festive stone, handiness. Cooking volume one, too much salt here. Turn on. Let's see. Chief Johnny Safasim, Z. Oh, Wendell she's still talking Nibar, to him. Zorbu, Shagaza, yeah, Tawazi. it's nice. Okay, um. Grai for Naka. Let's see. Robo Adama. Can we friendly? Just say goodbye. She's got to answer her phone. I'm sorry. It's great what you have to say, sir. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's my dead aunt from the grave. Oh, it's Kari Golden. Okay, I'll we'll talk to her. Hang holiday house lights. We already did that. <laughs> Nargle nicks. Woohoo with Corey. Nah, not gonna happen anytime soon. But I already hung the holiday house lights. Damn it! You're welcome, Taylor. I'm glad you're honored for it. I already hung the holiday house lights. I'm not rehanging them because I don't remember the numbers. And Isaac doesn't know how to be nice and to help me. Okay, get off the phone. You already, like, have one hand up her pussy. You don't need to deal with this any longer. Can you, can you maybe, here... Chew on that. Is this guy just... Okay, let's let's leave him. Let's go inside. We're gonna take a break from having to do any designing for the day. Because we're gonna work on the painting skill. Um, actually, you know what we're gonna do? So we're gonna take a quick trip over to... It's one of the stores here. Uh, not pets, pets, pets. But there is a store here that's... Well, first of all, let's see who needs renovations, because we can actually pick those up. Uh, Campa wants another renovation for another wash and dryer. Yeah, sure. Okay. Who else? Speak to client. Jennifer Winsington needs a uh, writing room, apparently. So sure, whatever. Okay. Jennifer, what is wrong with you? Okay. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna see about... Because she's not shy about the occult, as we've said. Like Angela was. Because Angela just didn't mess with any of that tomfoolery. So. We're gonna check. And see if there is. Go here. What is this? Impress Jennifer Woodsington. No. You don't need to impress anyone. You are perfect as you are. You will impress them later. <clears throat> 241, 123, 106. Damn it! It's too late! She's going to make her way. We're going to see if there's any potions worth having. Because she may not be a witch, but we can make use of their alchemical ingredients. We can also sell crap that we've been picking up. Who is this guy? Lowell Galindo. Heidi Fleming. Mm -hmm. Hello, Heidi. You're particularly special. Have you thought of going on a diet? What? Don't look at me like that, honey. We've got to consign. Add to the consignment list. Add to the consignment list. Add this. Add this. Consign those items. What potions? Essence of magic. That would turn her into a witch, which we're not doing. 1919, 1985. No! Uh, potent skill booster! Take a mammoth leap towards becoming more proficient in a skill. Yes. Cure elixir would be nice, but... We are gonna do that. And then we're gonna go home. 
We're gonna go home. So how does this thing work? Let's see. Take a mammoth leap towards becoming more proficient in a skill. So all we have to do is drink it and start painting, I'm assuming. Or cooking, depending on what we want her to do. I have played a witcher wizard in Sims and it's a lot of fun. But Samantha is not a witcher or wizard and she is not trying to become one. But she will buy the odd potion or two that will help her along her way to becoming perfect. And if the skill happens to increase her job performance as well, well, all the better, right? Right. Drink it. Now is the perfect time. Now practice painting, make it a large one. So many skills and so little time to get better at them. Samantha Pickering gained a huge skill boost towards mastering a skill. Uh... It's accepting the assignment. And new gifts. Yeah, I can't do that. What the hell is this? It's glorious is what it is. Oh my god. Oh my god. You sent a potion or two if the damn login would work? Yeah, I know, seriously. Thank you, sci-fi roots. I'll be I can probably get to them at one point way or another. <clears throat> The rules say to say that Dilly is numb, and I'm numb. Ah, oh, thank you. <laughs> it's because Isaac made the rules. And he was like, everyone needs to agree that he's numb. I'm like, honey, stop forcing everyone to like my. I love you. Don't don't flip me off. Don't do that. No, stop it. Ten out of ten artwork. Yeah, no, seriously. Let us not forget. But be freaking serious. Where? So butterscotch is lonely. Oh my god, you're forced to like Isaac. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, no, honey. Samantha has just improved her painting skill to level 4. She's really developing a personal style with her brush. What is this? Reach level 5 of a career? What level is she on right now? She's probably like level 4 or something. Yeah, she's on level 4. It's gonna take a while. She has to hug. Here, put that down. You gotta deal with the dog first. Um. But at least she's having a blast. Oh my god, we can hear the TV. Here. Even though the music's playing, I have the music muted so you can't hear the stereo at all. That's because if we have it, like, playing, EA sits there and, uh, just... <laughs> they mute out all the entire freaking stream. Oh, no, they, cop they copyright claim it. They copyright claim it and then only allow in certain countries. But yeah. So it makes it difficult for people to end up watching it. Aw, oh, Taylor, that's sweet. Oh god, where does she make money from? Probably consignment. Yep, consignment. Yeah, we have a little bit of money because we spent everything on the damn potion. She's got. Oh god! We can't even afford to have this fixed! We're gonna have to. We were taking a day off so we could end up doing this stuff, and now it's like. She's at the point where she's gonna have to. Like, work to fix the toilet. Ugh, no. Aww, Smooch the pet. How do you smooch? Affection. Care. Play. Screw it. You're gonna call for a repair technician and you are gonna continue your painting. Butterscotch is so adorable. Foreboding full moon is out! Butterscotch! 
is so worried. Butterscotch is always freaking worried about a full moon. All the do animals are. Don't worry, there's only like two zombies in this town. Coconut and someone else. Oh, my God. Zobe Laga. Tigu? Well, Honey, no, I'm not a more entertaining a person. Frugal. Stop it. Y yes, you're better, better at much needed sarcasm. Okay. And we're going to continue painting this glorious masterpiece where we watch the father mowing the lawn and the woman doing the chores, such as going shopping and making dinner, as she should be doing. Is the paparazzi just standing here? And we don't have a single freaking... Okay, whatever. Is this a common one? I think this is common. It's spotlight mushroom. It's common. What? What's the matter? No. Where are you going to hear screaming from? Oh, it's Lillian again. Lillian Madrano. Why is there screaming? Isaac thinks he's hearing screaming. You're guessing Isaac is the one who shops? No. We both do it, but I'm the one that prefers going shopping for most things. Jinx Sterling! Thank you for the sub! It's super sweet! Thank you for becoming a fuzzy! You're gonna be in the town at some point! Isaac has a lot of people to make. <sighs> yeah, I know you can. Actually, probably mm. right. sure. No. No, because I want to see her. She's all done. 50 simoleons. Good. Get out of the house because we don't have enough money. Butterscotch, you're super adorable. But I don't know what you're trying to do. You need to go here is what you need to do. What a lot of sims. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of sims. <clears throat> Why is this painting taking so long? One, because she's a perfectionist. So as a perfectionist as a sim, her stuff comes out as better quality than every other sim, but she also takes longer to do it. Two, it's a large painting. Look at how beautiful it is. She's also hungry. She's gonna have to eat. She's not gonna be able to finish this painting. It's gonna take too long. She's gonna have to go to bed and she's gonna have to deal with it in the next day. That's what's gonna have to happen. Mm. Samantha has been sent a giraffe family portrait from the manufacturer just for being a celebrity. It's been placed in Samantha's family shared family inventory. Oh my god! Guys, she was just gifted this! We need money, sell it. <laughs> <laughs> subs are subs. It's oh. true. Subs are subs. Hargle Narg. Mm. Um. Yeah, we share the channel. Congrats on our future marriage. You can actually see our engagement uh, on YouTube. You posted it. It's It's somewhere. It's not hard to find. You just YouTube on. Dilzik proposal. Because <laughs> uh, Isaac had me, uh, Isaac proposed to me while we were playing a dungeon in Final Fantasy with Minx and Chrism. And he had this elaborate whole plan that oh, I totally did not expect. It was very cute. Uh, uh... Don't watch Chrism's version of it, she cut it in a bad place. Watch our version, it's a better one. Though Chrism did cut it directly to its core. Oh my god, clean that up. It's ug it's disgusting. It's foul. How did you allow this to exist? Why is this guy still here? It's snowing. What does she want to do? Clean the unsinkable sink. She's tired, but she's going to clean the house. Which will include cleaning the unsinkable sink. There we go. Does she have 10,000 yet? Yes, she does. Okay, lifetime rewards. Let's see, what can she get for 10 grand? No jealousy. 
Immune to heat would be nice, but... There's a... What was the other one? There's an observant one, or is that... I already have that, I think. I think I'll hold on to it, and we'll see what we can get. When I can look over it a little bit more. Yeah, she has observant. She has speedy cleaner and legendary host. Because she is set to become the most perfect hostess ever! What? What? Oh, am I? <laughs> oh my god, Alex999! Nine, nine, nine. How dare you say fuck? Fucking fuckity fuck fuck. Demonetize. <laughs> Just... Oh my god, it's snowing, and there are leaves somewhere underneath the snow. Look! It looks almost exactly like where we live, and Isaac just screams bloody murder every time it snows. The next door neighbors have their lights up in their house that's far bigger than the one that we live in. We have small, meager beginnings. That's fine. Because maybe, just maybe, we can move on up. Oh, look at this. Butterscotch. Word around town is that Samantha Pickering is getting a lot of positive looks from her recent activities. People seem to be whispering Samantha's name. Keep up the good work. Samantha's now a notable figure. Yeah, she is. Well, of course she is. Wait, what does that mean? Oh, she's got a two-star rating. I don't know how the hell she gets a two-star rating. I don't know how the celebrity system works, but I know it's just like... I like Sims 1 better. Sims 1, you had to actually work for it. Sims 3, you kind of just let it happen, and it's, they, they just become mega celebrities on their own. I would shut it off, but I kind of like the celebrity system. I just wish it was harder to do. And I know there are mods out there that will slow down the amount of celebrity like points you gain for your Sim, but you, they still kind of just gain them on their own. It's not what I wanted. I want. I, I feel like your sim should only gain celebrity points for doing specific actions. That's what I'd like to have done. And that's not an apparent option. Oh my. Uh. <clears throat> Look, I like snow. But I'm still new to it. That's why I like snow. Everyone else is just like, it's horrible. And you should hate it. Also, it's 6.06 a.m. And we do not know where a single... There was no zombies. Maybe coconut is like somehow better or something. Are you alive, butterscotch? Because right now it's like, oh, you're about to become a full-fledged... Not a puppy. You're adorable as a puppy. Every day, we wake up and remember, what is this? Tug of War. Dag, dag. Oh. oh, she's gonna play Tug of War with her puppy. You don't have time for this! You have to become perfect for the day! Go! Stop it! Butterscotch is adorable, but Butterscotch can wait. Butterscotch, go sit outside in the snow. No, we can't do that. Butterscotch is such a perfect little puppy. So cute. So cute. Everyone is so goddamn nice. Just haven't been on the right day. I mean, <laughs> no. <laughs> it's Butterscotch's birthday today! A new toy or some loving attention is always appreciated. Don't break the toilet again! It's Butterscotch's birthday. Run around, peace, get a Shabbat full moon. Oh my god. We have to... What is this? Pillow fight with Jennifer and Wins Why? Why? Join the stylist career. Not yet. 
She was intended to always be a stylist at some point, and I believe that at some point she will become a stylist. But for now, she is learning by following in Angela's footsteps to become the next great innovation in town. And thank you for the bits! True love is the best, it's true. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Change the outfit, because your hair. No, stop it. Ah, noob! The shower broke! We're gonna have to call a repair person now. Simfest is starting at Oak Park. Do you see the snow? Oh my god. Continue painting. Hopefully this glorious painting will be able to end up in someone's living room. It's Butterscotch's birthday. You can't possibly leave the house while Butterscotch is like... Well... I mean, we could, but I don't think we have enough time to do a job, which means she's gonna have another day where she doesn't work. Which is fine. I suppose. Let's see her lifetime reward options. Uh... Fast, but no. Office here, no. Discount, no. No. Competitive, change it, no. No. The Hustler. No. Dead said it now. Eye candy. She could be beautiful. In ways. No. Simmunity. What is immunity? Super immunity that prevents you from getting nauseous, sick, and allergies. She is perfect. Let's see. Never dull. Sims love listening to you talk and will never get bored when you repeat social interactions. Samantha is perfect. She is never dull. Stop hitting the shower like that and actually fix it! Hmm. My god. Yeah! Can this woman just stop? She had an opportunity to get into Samantha's life and she mm. basically threw it out the window. Mm. So, whatever. Oh my god. Butterscotch. Butterscotch. Stop it. Oh, dear lord. Is she playing with you? Yes. Cause Samantha just completed a painting valued at 127 simoleons. <clears throat> Let's see. We're gonna have to name this. What are we naming it? The Life and Times of Ben Masai. Has it? Okay. It's A S I A I. Of Ben Life and Times of Ben Masai. Take it. Mm -hmm. Most wonderful time of the year, the winter festival is here. The hot chocolate is flowing and the fire logs are glowing, and everyone's spreading the cheer. Whether you skate or you shred, don't fall on your head you can always improve for next year so for those who don't know that is a hidden skill the sims 3 do pick up which is uh ice skating or skating it's uh you never can actually see it actually improving but they do improve <clears throat> oh butterscotch butterscotch is adorable butterscotch is the perfect puppy Paint some something worth 150 simoleons. That is very possible. We're gonna start with another large painting. Because apparently her painting is increasing her job experience by a shit ton. Holy crap! She's only on level 4. She needs to be on level 5. But she also says that her surroundings are dirty. Why are they dirty? From what? Is it from something that's been abused? I can't replace more crap if you've broken stuff! <clears throat> oh my god. I don't know what is supposed to be dirty. Uh, 
Um, if she, if something in the house was dirty, she should have the option to just clean house. Your painting is LSD material. It's perfect. Go, Samantha. Paint your heart's content. We'll deal with redesigns the next day. Right now, we are mostly concerned about this most auspicious of days. Butterscotch's birthday. I don't know how you trigger in Butterscotch. Um... What is her problem right now? Hunger? You know what I just realized? No, nah, never mind. Hmm. Um, you see a cloud state coming from the middle of the fridge. Oh, 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 oh. It's the, it's the leftovers. Thank you. How did I not see that? How long am I going to be going for? I'm going to be ending after this day ends, I think. We'll find out. Um. Can we skitch about the full moon or run around? Or eat from a bowl? Or chew? Let me see. <clears throat> like, there's no special, like, birthday anything to do for him. Her. It's just... Okay. <laughs> Butterscotch is adorable. We have to toss the autumn sa uh, the autumn salad. It's too much. She needs to clean out the bad food, and then she needs to have a quick meal of green salad. A green salad, a delicious green salad that she can sit down and munch on, and apparently choke on. It's a freaking green salad. How are you choking? Why is he here? I hope you die of freezing cold. Like, seriously. Why is he here? Have a water balloon fight. It's brilliant. What do you search? Is this guy just staring in the window the entire time? Super creepy. <coughs> Let's see. Um. No! Ah! I didn't mean to do that. Ah, oh, well. New painting. Her skill's still going up, that's what matters, honestly. Ah, <sighs> there should be an accident room for the stalker. <clears throat> There's no accident room. There was a guest room that Angela had, but Angela's property was large enough to accommodate for that. Samantha does not have a very large property! Sorry, RJ has creeps. Chris, Sorry, I didn't mean to. I accidentally told her to just scrap the painting. I did not mean to. Um. <coughs> Come on, painting. She's not gonna finish this one. There's no way. There's absolutely no way she's gonna finish this painting. Now, she's gonna have to start redesigning some people's places starting next Sunday. This has been a glorious day for her. Where she has just worked to better herself. We're not answering that because it's probably Huggy. We're just gonna leave that phone, okay? I'm gonna use the bathroom. 
And we are gonna wash your hands and she's gonna go to bed. Wait! 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 What's happening? It's the birthday party for for butterscotch! Butterscotch! We're so happy for you! Oh my god! Everyone! Happy birthday, Butterscotch! Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Ladorva Gorg. <laughs> butterscotch, she's so adorable. Mm. You know. Barnacle. Just. Just. <laughs> oh. Revez? Oh. <laughs> butterscotch trickering has just become an adult. What do you- <sighs> Guys! Guys! Before you say anything, have I not been clear? Puppies are perfect accessories! Doggos aren't! Samantha's perfect! Butterscotch needs to go. We'll get a new one, don't worry. The next one will name chocolate. Or marshmallow. Or maybe caramel. <laughs> It's been nice knowing you. You've been adorable. We're not gonna. Don't, 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 don't hug. Don't hug Butterscotch. So it's becoming un, unnecessarily attached. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's uh, just. It's just. No, I don't, I don't know. What? You wanna end it then? Ours, Glory, and Gold is streaming. Ours, Glory, and Gold is streaming, guys! Everybody, we're ending the stream for today. Thank you for coming. Savannah is perfect. Don't you dare say otherwise. We will be continuing living by Samantha starting next Sunday when you can watch the government come and take Butterscotch away and replace him with, I think, a kitten this time. <laughs> Thank you for coming and have a wonderful one. Good night, everyone. <laughs>